YouTube was good. It's your boy Jody Joe. Welcome to Jody's Corner Live, number eighteen. Yeah. Thank you guys so very much for tuning in. <laughs> I am Jody Joe. Thank you guys for being here. I appreciate you very much. I really do. I really do. To my left, special guest Ronan Joe again. Triple. Good morning. Happy Monday. Hope everybody on the panel is doing great. I'm having a good week. Good weekend so far. Movie talk, man. Let's get it. Movie talk. Movie we talk. love it. Thank you for being here, Ronan. It's yep. always good when you're here. Another special guest on the other side of the table. That's the Flash, man. Yo, what's up, y'all? <laughs> oh, <laughs> just what? as corny as he is horny. Yep. <laughs> Two strokes. Man. Yep. And now y'all see something new on me, right? My do rag. I'm about to cut my hair soon. About to cut it. I'm about to cut it. About to let it go. But let. Well, I'm gonna go wave my mom. My original style back in the day. Well, not back in the days, but you know. All right, for sure. I'm going to cut my hair, too. Uh, speaking of cutting hair, get your ears ready because <laughs> HT3 is in the building. Ah! Milky. What's happening, people? Yeah. What's up with it? What's up with it, homie? Yeah, so we here, y'all. We here. So, uh. <clears throat> yeah, my name is like B Rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> B rabbit, <laughs> you want your B rab status? Yeah, he has a he has a do rag on it. It's pretty funny. And uh, yeah, shout out to people getting sniped in the chat. Eastar, shout out to Eastar for being the second female subscriber to be initiated in the five hundred dollar club. Eastar, East take a bow, my lady. Eastar. Take a bow. Yeah. She dropped 500 on Team Sus. Team Sus. Team hey, Sus. Hey, I appreciate that 125, Ishtar. That buck in the coda. I love you. That buck in the coda. That's a bag of the chips and a drink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Back in the days, that would give us four bags. Ishtar, my lady, thank you very much. Shout out to you. Mm -hmm. Everything is good, everybody. Let's go ahead nah, and also. start. You guys raise anything, uh, any updates, anything that you guys have? Oh, I think I can think of one. You can come and meet the Justice League <laughs> this Friday. We are literally four days away. Four days away. From our event four that we're days, throwing. Man. There are people flying from all over the country to come and see us. This Friday, June 21st, we are having an event at State Brewery. Brewing fresh beer. There will be food vendors. We're creating our own games like Pictionary and Charades and a Smash Brothers tournament on the Switch. Come and see the Just Us League. We will all be there and we'll be there live, hosting mm -hmm. a live stream this Friday. From 4 to 10 p.m. at 1237 West 134th Street, Gardena, California, 90247. What do you guys think? You guys ready about for that? Man, yeah. that at the time comes, it's getting closer and closer. My anxiety level is just going higher and higher. Uh. It keep taking you higher and higher. Yeah. Uh, uh. You know that the devil is a liar. Uh, I just can't wait till, it be, it's, till it's over it's and you don't have fun, man. Yeah. The alcohol, man. Uh. <laughs> are you, are you going to get chocolate wasted? <laughs> I'm gonna get chocolate wasted. Chocolate, chocolate bro. Ain't wasted. nothing like a chocolate waste. I don't, you know what? I don't know if I can because I might drive. X Files will be there. Everybody will be there. Even the code will be there. Yeah. Everybody gonna pull up. You gonna see everybody. Ain't nobody gonna be like, oh, dude, which McCauley not come? Because if they don't come, they won't ever. You'll never see them again on camera. <laughs> they will be there. Ronan will be there. He said he took the day off. So everybody, your favorite's gonna be there. Everybody favorite gonna be there. Ronan, are you excited to meet some of the subs, man? I am, man. Uh, this is a big event <coughs> for everything and uh, and everybody. Uh, I think it's cool, man. I've never been a part of anything like this. I'm used to watching behind the scenes uh -huh. and stuff like that. Uh, yeah. So it's gonna okay. be interesting interacting and uh, hosting and just doing all the stuff that we normally do, but live in front of the people, man. I'm I'm excited for that. Yeah. I'm excited I for you, great, man. man. I think I think it's good for everybody to get it, be a part. If of you feel it. a little uneasy, I can make you feel better. You know. Make, so what, appreciate you that. what are you gonna do to him? Speed Force. What's he gonna do? What do you mean? You feel better? They're gonna go back Something in time gay? and warn me, and he's gonna come back to the future and change everything, right? Uh, yeah. I mean, if you want to put it like that. I okay. 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 <laughs> gay. Gay. Yeah. All right, so, <laughs> let's go ahead and get it right. I, I, I try. I try to 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 sus Ronan, and uh, he I didn't know. like it too much. I know. So. Yeah. I know. Hey, I, hey, I he know. tried to kill I, us. I know, man. Like, like, I, uh, like. I, I oh no. That's true. He tried to punch his wife with his full strength. <laughs> almost, like a, almost like an E moment. Like, almost like, like he didn't know. You I'm know? glad you remember. You know, no, he he don't he don't I'm know that we're we're, we're 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 all brothers and family and we yeah, love each other. Right, 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 right. <laughs> There's a limitation. When to you that. touch him, it's over. Yeah, no. It's like it's over. But why though? He, he just gave us that uh 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 
Tsunami punt. The, the tsunami yeah, I know, I know, but 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 uh, as far as the event goes, man, uh, I'm very excited. Yeah. Um, it, I've been wanting to meet a lot of y'all for a very long time. You know, I'm gonna give out hugs and kisses, bro. Like I'm keeping it straight, straight, no homo, but still sus. You know what I mean? Like, like I can't wait. You know, you know how? Oh no, I don't know how that work, but 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 I'm gonna do it. Uh, it worked. It worked. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna beat people in Smash. I'm gonna just have some one on one people, you know, uh, people to talk to. Uh, I have this one um, subscriber that gave me a long, nice message, you know, and, and she coming down a, a, a turnaround trip. Dope. You know, so just, just coming to meet us, you know, and, and that that's a good feeling, you know, <clears throat> because some I, I don't wanna say I take this for granted, but it's like when you're here and, and like we're just talking amongst ourselves. You know what I mean, and and then we get into it, and we kind of me, I kind of like f- forget that people are watching us. It's tight, you, you, you know. People are uh, 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 watching us, yeah. learning mm-hmm. from us, mm-hmm. getting um, laughs from us. People can have a a bad day, and then mm-hmm. we make them have a better day. Nice. You know, and then for us to have this event, and for the people to come to us, and like, oh my god, like I'm seeing you guys in person. This yeah. is awesome. You know, like 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 you know fire. Oh, make okay. you feel good. Like make okay. you feel good about yourself. You know, like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm here, you know, like yeah. like let's, let's let's have a little one on one chat, you know what I mean? Yeah. Get sushi, you feel me? Your wrist in the tub later that night. Um. Oh, um yeah, it's a it's a good yeah, thing. It's a really I'm good excited. Thing. <laughs> yeah. I'm Jesus excited. Christ. Here we go. <laughs> Pray for me, y'all. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right, so yeah, uh, let's go ahead and get right into the topic, guys. Let's start this off. Let's uh, box office weekend, right? What do we have? Men in Black, mm-hmm. and we had Shaft. Those are the tent poles, right? Yeah, that's funny. Men in Black and Shaft. Let's go ahead and read a little something, something, see what we could uh, come up with. Uh, as Men in Black International and Shaft joined the growing list of underperforming sequels this year, an oh, wow. ignominious, ignominious, how uh, ignominious. Group that includes <laughs> Dark Phoenix <laughs> and Godzilla, King of the Monsters. Words for franchise fatigue are beginning to simmer in Hollywood. Sony hoped that adding a fresh female face to the historically male-led series would help make Men in Black International feel less stale. Oh, God. oh my. But even a standout performance from Tessa Thompson, who reunited <clears throat> with her Thor Ragnarok co-star Chris Hemsworth to much acclaim, couldn't fill the shoes of the original stars Will Smith and Tommy Lee Jones. Critics labeled it a forgettable installment, with Variety's chief film critic Peter DeBruge calling the film a, quote, mess, unquote. Though Shaft shared similar underwhelming sentiments from critics, those who bought tickets to see Samuel L. Jackson return to the big screen did seem to enjoy the film. It got an A cinema score compared to a B for Men in Black International. That kind of turnout suggests that Shaft was marketed too broadly, leaving it unable to break out among its core audience. Hmm. Sony's release of Men in Black International debuted with a disappointing 28.5 million from 4,224 locations. By comparison, this is the lowest in franchise history by over 20 million, as all three of the previous Men in Black films opened with over $51 million. Hmm. Disney's release of Dark Phoenix centered its second weekend, dropping a massive 72.6% for an estimated 9 million three day. <laughs> and a dem- uh, uh, <laughs> I'm not sure, but you missed that. Hey, uh, Jody Joe, uh, you missed that negative sign. Uh, I no, know. It was a negative sign right there. 72% drop, right? Like, drop. That's why I, I got. Uh, I couldn't finish it. Uh, Wait a minute. Let me start over with the Dark Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> Disney's release of Fox's Dark Phoenix centered <clears throat> in a second weekend, dropping a massive 72.6% for an estimated 9 million three day at domestic. At domestic gross that tops fifty one million. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. Wait. That's terrible. Wait, wait, wait. Hold I'm on. about to pass out. Wait, wait. So, so, I'm about to pass out. So, 51 million is what? I'm about to pass out. That's 
That's nothing. Well, no, 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 no. <laughs> they even make that money, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on. $51 million is what, is what they have right total, now currently? Total, total in America. Total. It currently under, right now? Yeah. It underperformed. Yeah, it, underperformed. it made $9 million this whole weekend. <laughs> <laughs> God, that's crazy. Yeah. Father's Day weekend. Don't fathers go see movies, that's man? Shit, man. I want to see a movie. The word got out. They ain't seen, <laughs> <on, laughs> they seen <laughs> on Phoenix. The word got out. Uh, oh, wait, wait. In, in, Bruh. in three days, it only made nine million. Bro, in three days, it that, made nine milli. In three, that's Friday. That's the that's worst Saturday, X-Men Saturday, history, huh? I think Next the actor will be on Blu-ray. DVD. We're going to see the trailer. Take this shit out of theaters, bro. Netflix. They got to take that shit out of Netflix. This is crazy, they, bro. They got to take that shit out the theaters now. Immediately. They're trying to sell as many Blu-rays and DVDs as possible. They, they might need to throw that thing back to VHS, my G. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Just to get those old people that be on the corner of the store. Oh, that's a dark feeling. Let me pick it up for my grandbabies. And they know they don't want it. Uh-huh. You know how grandmas uh-huh. come with sheep? Dark nah. Phoenix. Oh, my God. That's, that's terrible. Cool. So, Dark Phoenix is absolute. It's Head in the water. Look at that. Nine million. A domestic gross. So its entire time in America, it made fifty-one million dollars. And they only them been here about two weeks now, right? Well, well, yes. What was their budget? The budget. I don't know. Some. It's over a hundred million. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh million. yeah. I heard it was like around one hundred fifty, two hundred. Oh my god. Yeah. No. 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 Two fifty. Two fifty. Dark Phoenix had a two hundred fifty million dollar budget. The reshoots and all that. I, okay, read, I read it. Okay, I read like, it in like, an where, article. Where, oh, so they reshoot. Even more. Where did that two fifty go? <laughs> it went to Not the, no CGI. Uh, uh, the original cost, and then the reshoots and all that. Yeah, yeah. yeah up, up to two hundred fifty million dollars, bro. That's a lot. huge L coming <clears throat> coming Fox's Sorry. way. But the, you know they got they got bought and destroyed. But running, uh, I want to know what your take on the Men in Black is. The, the thing that I want to talk about the most, you could chime in on any movie that we we, we, we listed here. Aladdin right, yeah. is still doing good. It did about sixteen. I think it was about sixteen. It, that's it, a good it, movie. It's at seven hundred and twenty-five million dollars worldwide right now. That's a good movie, bro. Well, I didn't, I didn't so think, it's 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 yeah. crawling yeah. there a little bit. It's still it's still alive. It's doing better than all the other. I didn't movies. think Aladdin was gonna flop. Endgame's still in there too. Uh-huh. Endgame's kind of like dead in the water. But 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 it, it, it's it's like 50, 50 million away from from uh, from Avatar yeah, worldwide. Yeah. Uh, uh, good luck with that. That uh, kind of went down. But I don't slow. think he's gonna it get was, there though. It's, 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 it's not gonna make it, bro. It's not gonna make it, man. man. Endgame's not gonna make it, bro. It probably will. It. DVD is if they count DVD sales. Probably will. Well, nah, yeah. DVD sales never they count. They never count DVD sales. Man, let me holler at my man Q Reviews for donating twenty dollars in this motherfucker, bro. Q Reviews. I'm sorry for getting that too late, bro. But we had to let that. He says, I wish I could be there, man, and drink some of that good brew with y'all. No, man. I wish you could, too, man. Q, I don't know if you noticed, but we got some people coming from all over the country flying in, man. We got a we got a, we got a, a woman who's coming from an unknown state far away, mm-hmm. coming in on Friday to fly in, kicking with us for a few sure. hours, and flying back out. Shout out to... I, I'm, I don't I'm, know if you want to put her out there. It's the first name. It's the first name. It's the first name. Mm-hmm. Not last. First name. Uh, I don't know if um, we want to do that either. No, no, yeah, yeah. Uh, we no don't names. know if she wants to be out there like that. <clears throat> so yeah, so we that's dedication, Never dedication. Mind. So uh, yeah, Q. Uh, next time, bro. Next time you'll pull up, bro. But uh, Flash. Oh yeah, Ronan. Yeah, Ronan. 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 <laughs> <laughs> we chimed in so much. I'm so sorry. Yeah, yeah. No, y'all be good, chiming good. in like a motherfucker. All right. Uh, box office, yeah. Box Do what it. You feel, what you feel about the box office, bro? Sp- particularly Men in Black, and then whatever else you want to talk about. Men in like, Black and uh, X Men Dark Friends. I'm not too surprised. These are popular franchises, though. But I feel like audiences are catching on, and it's so dear to them. I think people are losing steam and they're losing interest, and uh, the box office results are showing that. Mm. Uh, it, no one has a taste for it. And then you got actors there that people really didn't want to see in those franchises, um, Men in Black mainly. Tessa uh, Thompson, like, who, who do you think they didn't want to see? Tessa Thompson and, and Chris Hemsworth? I both. Think, I think both. Man. You don't think a lot of people wanted to see them? I mean, you, we can't use the mm. Marvel hype for Thor. I mean, this is Men in Black. There's some that is completely Correct. different. Uh, Men in Black is more of a consistent franchise. You right. know what I'm saying? So when you bring in new blood like that, it kind of tarnishes it. I mean, mm-hmm. it's hard to really build on what Will Smith and Tom Lee Jones did. They are the oh, anchors. Yeah, like, yeah, when yeah. you see those, when you see specific franchises, you think certain stars. Men in Black is Tom Lee and Will, you know, it's them. You can't replace Will Smith and Tom Lee it's Jones a tough thing to do. with Tessa Thompson and Chris Hemsworth. And you can't be like, oh, well, we're going to bring in the stars from Thor Ragnarok to come in and 
brand new Men in Black. Here you go. Take it. And yeah. it, uh, what? It throws everything off. So, and the box office shows that uh, X-Men, I think they messed up by riding that wave trying to come out with a Dark Phoenix movie when we were supposed to get that at the end of X2. Right. Logan ended it and satisfied everything. They won. Like, that was it. And then making Dark Phoenix, they was like, well, let's just milk it. And I think Logan was the perfect send-off, so they kind of tarnished that movie hmm. by coming out with this. But the, we know the only reason they did it was because <clears throat> MCU's about to get it and revamp it. Dark Phoenix was unnecessary. Men in Black International was unnecessary. Uh, the other movies, uh, Shav, it seemed like it, it kind of performed the way it did. It's, it's mixed So Shav made $9 million. Yeah, they said critics were kind of... Made kinda, $9 million over the weekend. Kind of uneven on it. really low. They were expecting $16 million. They got yeah. about 9 or 10 But then even that's tricky, too, because we hadn't had that Shaft movie for like a decade, you know. Rest yeah. in peace to the late John Singleton and stuff. Almost two decades, bro. It's, uh, it's yeah. a little tricky on that one because, you know, black exploitation is kind of a thing that kind of comes away and kind of fades a little bit. You know, it comes here and there. Shaft was good, though. Yeah, that's it what I'm It was saying. good. That's why it's disappointing. It should have made, it made, nine, it made nine, more than $9 million. And then you got audiences... The new generation that really doesn't really know about that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so go see Shaft this weekend, guys. So in that phase, <clears throat> star power good. can work. Yeah, so good. people have come to see Samuel Jackson, Richard Roundtree, to the old cats that know about him. It's tricky, you know what I'm saying? Now you're going for now you're relying on star power for a movie like that. You know what I'm saying? So it's very different though. But I mean, the box office is what it is. I'm not surprised on the results. But uh, the movies that did do well, a lot of people aren't talking about, and the stuff that's not doing well, everybody's talking about. It's, it's a flip to it. You know what I mean? It's crazy. People are questioning Toy Story now in the in the chat. Oh. People are wondering in Toy Story. People are worried about Toy Story's box office. I'm mm -hmm. not. I mean, that'll sell itself, though, man. Toy Story uh, is kind of like a, a uh, safe bet. You know what I mean? Disney, you know how Pixar not runs really. that. But Toy Story is... Maybe not a safe bet. The, the expectations uh, for Toy Story are, are I mean, clearly do, over do a billion. Do really see Toy Story flopping? Well, no, 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 no. It's not going to flop. That's what I was getting at. No, it's not no, going to flop. Not, 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 flop. It's not a flopping it's not gonna make situation. It, not flop, but just <clears> it won't It won't make it... As much money as we think it will, because mm -hmm. I that's you, what yeah. I think. Because yeah. it, it, it's their they're milking that franchise. Oh yeah, yeah. No, yeah. you know yeah. this fourth one shouldn't even be out. It right. should not. They're milking that. Three yeah. had a great ending. So I mean, again, that could be a different situation. I don't. I don't know how the Disney audience is today, but I know when you they show that title, people come and see it. It's, it's very different, like versus like a, a Marvel movie or something. Like Disney, when I when I say safe bet, I mean like you kind of know what you're getting when you go to see it. With comic book movies, you kind of kind of have to raise your eyebrow because there's a little more history and knowledge thrown in, but then you kind of have to check that at the door, too. Disney, you know what you're getting when you're coming into the animated and live action stuff. That's what I mean For by the most safe part, bet. Yeah. yeah. So it's, it's a gamble, however you look at it. And, and, and that's coming out this this Thursday, Friday. Child's Play. Child's Play. Mm -hmm. oh, it, it, Child's, Child's Play and Toy Story. You're yeah. right. You're absolutely oh my. right. I, I, okay, this is not about talking about that. You're right. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I definitely Fox think that Shaft Lord. is the movie this weekend that, that you guys should go see. <clears throat> if I'm going to pick a movie for you guys to see, uh, besides Toy Story, look like Shaft going to be the one. Shaft should be the one, in my opinion. Wait, wait. And, uh, even... Even next week? I mean, uh, th this week? It's still it's still Shaft? I said Toy Story after Toy Story Shaft. Everybody's not, everybody don't want to watch a kid's movie. Mm. That's why Child's Play is coming out the same day as Toy Story. I agree with that. To get those adults, to get those 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 tweens, to get them. Because everybody ain't going to go check for those Toy Story. You're going to get story kids. Four. You're going to get people our age who kind of are still like lingering on our childhood. And adults bringing their kids. Besides that, who's going to... I might never go see a, a, a Toy Story. I might never go do it. See do that? it to myself. I'm not. Crazy. Gonna, I'm see not. That? I'm not. I don't like how when they change up storylines. What do you mean? They change. They change Toy Story of all. I'm not talking about. But, but Toy Stories. I'm not talking about Toy Story. I'm talking about Child's Play. Oh yeah. No. Oh, that oh. doll look derpy as hell. The real bro. Toy Story. That doll. Yeah. That, 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 <laughs> the, the real Toy Story. The real Toy Story. Yeah. Hey, that, that'd be some cool marketing. <laughs> yeah. The real that, Toy Story. Yeah. yeah that, that doll. That doll is 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 is, is chat. That doll yeah. is, uh, yeah, but as far as, as far as the box office, man, uh, I went to I went to see Man in Black last night. Um, first, uh, I can't be the first one to say I'm sorry. I'm, so, <laughs> I'm so sorry. You had to put yourself through that film. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, as far as, as far as far as Man in Black, man, um, I was I was in bed. It was. The last showing was at 9 p.m. at the bridge over here in uh, Cover City. And it was 8 o'clock. I was half asleep. Woke up like, oh, man, like, I want something to do. You were half asleep? 
You were half asleep, and okay. then you went. Then you went to go see Men in Black. Yeah. Prediction: Jody Domus. You fell asleep in the movie. No, no, I didn't. Uh, I didn't. Break. I didn't. <laughs> I, 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 they, they, they had, they had, they had some, some very, very good fresh popcorn that I was munching on. <clears throat> if, it, if it wasn't for the food, then maybe. Uh, but, yeah, but yeah, I was the popcorn, early was, the popcorn was fresh. Huh? Popcorn was good. No, movie. no, no. I think they just made a fresh batch. You no know, popcorn yeah. saver movie for me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so so I went there, you know, and I was expecting. I mean, He's look, okay, from from the trailers, man, I'm like, okay. It, it's not gonna be like the the OG films, you know, uh, and and I haven't seen three all the way through. I seen one and two, haven't seen three all the way through. Um, this movie was uh, uh, a dumpster fire, bro. You know, and the, and the, it was the that one that one old female actor one with the white hair. She's she's what's her name? I don't know her name, but she's. Fantastic! Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Olive, she's a great actress. Yeah, and then, and then uh, when, when she was like, "Yeah, yeah, you can be part of the Men in Black," and then Tess was like, "The Men in Black," and then she was like, "I already know, I already, already tried, you know, to to yeah. to change." I'm like, man, they put in, they, they yeah, throwing it in there like that, you know, like like good, like S- S-A-W, S-A-W. yes, yes, you know, and then and then, and then uh, Thor, it's just, it's just the the whole the whole. I can see why it's. It was. It's not. It's not. It's a mess. Well. It's a big dark a, cloud around this a, stupid movie. It's a mess. That the the plot was was everywhere, bro. Like, come on, that was a a, a kindergarten child's play plot storyline, bro. The way she found the men in black and how she got recruited, bro. That no spoilers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that was mind blowing, man. Like, I, 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 I are you took, serious? So the, the most prestigious place in the planet. That's how you, man. I mean, Will Smith had to chase down a, a alien running thirty miles an hour up buildings and jumping off rooftops in order for him to get the attention of, of K. Exactly, exactly. And, then, and then how how she just walked in there. But yeah, yeah. And, yeah. But I like I like how they gave they gave the the little the little homage to to Will Smith and Tommy Lee Jones that you know in the uh, the pictures. You, they, you think that was homage? Because I think they pissed on they, him a little bit. They they showed that in, in the in the trailer. So. She disrespected that noisy cricket. What do you mean? Mild spoiler, guys. She picks up the noisy cricket for her weapon as she's weaponing up. She's like, mm, no, I don't think so. Uh-huh. She picked up a I, big gun, bro. I thought, I thought, you know, you know where, where my mind goes, but I thought that a she cock. Was, I thought she was talking about small, big cock. Uh-huh. I thought, I thought she picked it up like, uh, it's small, uh, ain't that big? Give me, give me that big, nah, that big sh- ten inch thick cock. No, that was it, a shot. Was that that was a sure? shot, bro. You sure? Uh, okay, because because that shot, bro. That good's that powerful. That, that good's powerful. Cricket? That good's powerful. The noisy cricket will get ricking on you, straight from the raps, bro. Okay, okay, okay. You don't it, want a noisy cricket getting ricking on you. It, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was it was a dumpster fire, man. To the to the the main villain, to the side villains. No spoilers. To the side the, <clears throat> the side villains were uh just thrown in there, dancing and hip hop b boys. <laughs> Wow. That like, bro, bro, really? bro, those villains were. <sighs> I didn't even talk about them in my rant. Yeah, you did. <sighs> it's just uh, I can see how 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 people you know is this made it's made this money like this. What up, Bobo? It was it was a weak film, um, but I'm glad I'm glad that um, Aladdin is doing uh, still doing well. Mm-hmm. I love Aladdin. Um, what's out there? Uh, haven't seen Ma. Uh, how was Godzilla doing? Godzilla? Ma is good. Godzilla's suffering. It's suffering too. God, Ma's Ma's uh, doing great. Ma's you know great. the budget's something like five million dollars. Yeah, okay, yeah. I can assume debut that. with like nineteen million. Yeah, it's already popping. Yeah, Four so hours, yeah, you know how to go. Yeah, uh, uh, Men in Black is um, uh, fresh in my mind. So like, I, I got I got to talk about it. It's just it's just uh, she. This wasn't needed. I mean, like. To what you said, yeah. you can't replace the iconic Tommy Lee Jones and Will Just Smith. Can't. You can't do it, and 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 it, it, it well, like they even tried to do it. They 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 didn't even try to get good actors. Like, look, look, no, Tessa. What's wrong she, with Tessa? T- Tessa, she's not. She's not a. She's not a good bad actor, yeah. actor, but she's not, she's a, not good a good one either. either. Right, she's right, right. she's average. Yes. Chris Hemsworth. Okay, here we go, Chrissy uh-huh. Chris. Chris. Oh, Doing. Look, I thought at first that he played a good Thor. It, it it's not hard to play a good Thor 
because because the way Thor is portrayed in the MCU is kind of boring. You know, he he didn't have no uh uh it wasn't no levels to him. You know, like and I, and I don't care Ragnarok. Ragnarok, it, 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 that that he was he was just a goofball in there. You know, and then they tried to make him more serious, but still kind of goofy at the same time. They try to give him good serious scenes and an end game, but then go back to to no 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 no. They try to give him good scenes in a uh, uh, Infinity War. You know, you know, and I always thought that one scene where he was in the ship with, with Rocket, that was a good scene for me. Jody, you didn't think that was a good scene. I thought no. I thought it was a great scene. I'm trying to cover up his feelings with laughter. Uh, but then uh, they turn him into a fat slob in Endgame. And then uh, it, it, I just don't get that arc they was trying to do with him. And him him and Ghostbusters, trash, Cut. S- stupid. Uh, him. Cut boy. Uh, I watched uh, Bad Times at Casino Royale. At the El Royale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. El Royale. Casino yeah. Royale is a pretty darn good film. Yeah, it, I was like, wait, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't do that. It, it feels like his, it wasn't a lot, but his accent, his American accent, his American country accent was just, ugh. Uh, he was like, he, he played like a, a cult, Worshipper, yeah. leader type person, uh, yeah, whatever. Mixed bag, yeah. This film, he played like he didn't want to be there. He 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 rested on, 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 and his fame and the name. Like he didn't yeah. his name. He didn't really try hard he in was, this film. He was the same character he was in Ghostbusters. He was the same character, wow. bro. And and, and Thor Ragnarok. And, and, and yeah, yeah. Same and, guy. And, and and if he wanted to 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 try to catapult. This franchise, it, it, it felt like he didn't, he didn't have that passion to try to uh, catapult this franchise. You, you know, trying to uh, uh, make it uh, go on. It, it, it seemed like he just wanted to have fun. He wanted to have fun, and and the way he said, "Hey man, you're 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 different, man. You you ain't the same person that you was when you, you know, uh, uh, did something back in time. You know, like it, no 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 spoilers. Oh man, you everybody keeps saying that." You you you're, you're acting different, man. You ain't the same one. Uh, uh, Chief said, "Man, you been you always been like this, you know, uh, cocky and reckless stuff like that." And, well, well, yeah, you know, like you he wasn't trying to be something great. And I feel if they acted better in this film, it would have been a better film than what it was, you know. But so still filth garbage. But it would have been uh, dumpster fire. It would have been just bad. But this this film was just like uh, so I give it just the F, you know. It, 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 if they if they really tried I in give, these roles, have you seen my review? No, not yet. I gave it an F too. Okay, mm. well we, it's trash. On the same page. But but it, if they try to to put some effort into this film, man, then it, it would have been like D plus D plus. But yeah, man, like it's so still bad. That's yeah, 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 yeah. It's still it's still a bad film, man. Like it, it deserves. Is it better than Dark Phoenix? Said BJ. Uh, yeah, BJ. Is it better than Dark Phoenix? Oh man, we just comparing garbage now, huh? Is it better? Uh, it's like it's like okay, okay, okay. One okay. trash is dirtier than the other trash. <laughs> okay, it's like it's equal. Okay, it okay. Equal man, to what man in Black. Man in Black is <laughs> a, a, a a trash can filled with baby diapers on a hot summer's day. Dark Phoenix is. That same trash can filled with human throw up on a hot summer's day. What would you rather smell? Baby diapers or throw up? Neither. Exactly. Get a big one. Big one. Exactly. Get a big one. It's, it's, baby diapers. Uh, okay. There we go then. At least baby diapers had a little baby powder, right? <laughs> that that so powder's bad. gone through that. <laughs> what are you talking about? People, people underestimate how bad piss smells when there's a lot of it. Yeah. <laughs> That shit will make you gag, bro. Yes, it will. <laughs> it will. I was on a Greyhound bus to Vegas one time, <coughs> and that porter potty in the back of the bus, bro. Did you sit in the back, bro? I was in the back. You, you sit in the oh, back, yeah. bro. Bro. Every time that door opened up, <laughs> <laughs> people were plugging their nostrils up with with one, one finger each hand. <laughs> bro. Uh, Ooh, piss will make you gag, bro. Hell, man. But, uh, Ooh, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 make sure uh, uh, everybody's insides. So pit. many different smells of urine pit, and oh. 
piss piss when, when you drink no water is is, is just terrible, bro. Yeah, 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 it's, bro. It's, it's it's terrible. It's it's it's, it's, it's really bad. Bro. So 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 to touch your question, uh, I feel just given just given the X Men, just being that it's X Men, I will give it to Dark Phoenix. <laughs> yeah, Dark, so did I. Dark Dark Phoenix is better. It is. Than it's it might better. be. It's better, it, it, bro. It, it, it's better. It's not better. not by much, man. But, but it's better. But but it's that man. Uh, That's a, a shame. Dark, Dark Phoenix got freaking uh, uh, Michael Fassbender and freaking James McAvoy, bro. I said the helicopter scene. Hey, get to the chopper and go! <laughs> that mess is awesome, bro. Yeah, bro. This don't have that. Bro, it, this movie don't have no action. It, it, don't, uh, it, it, it don't. It don't. Wow. This movie has no action, bro. No action, bro. It's an action movie without action. Those, 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 those two twins. And when you add these now. twin idiots right yeah, here, yeah, when yeah, you add them fools, it gets worse. Where they at? Where them dancing hip hop and idiots? These motherfuckers. What the? When you add them to the mix, <laughs> they, huh? they are the worst. They rival the villain from Logan. No. Yeah, bro. Uh, what no. villain no, Logan? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. No, right. The villain from Logan is trash, and they uh, rival him, bro. Uh, yeah, hey, I don't want to go that far. To oh, yeah, you don't have to, but I did. <laughs> Jesus. They were absolutely nothing, bro. Yeah. Absolutely nothing. Okay, so Flash, uh, what's your take on the box office? Um, Beyonce backup dancers for, uh, for <laughs> Men in Black, right? I mean, for the whole for the yeah, whole weekend, the, the whole the, weekend, Shaft, Men in Black, whatever. <clears throat> I wanted to go check out Men in Black, but I after hearing uh, how bad it is, and now hearing more bad news about it, it's like I don't even want to go check it out now. I mean, I wasn't expecting to for it to do much just because they didn't have uh, Will and. Um, Tommy Lee Jones and Tommy Lee Jones in it because Tommy Lee and uh, Will they had great chemistry in that movie. What up, Boise? They 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 really worked that movie out together, and without that chemistry, I don't think that you would have a good uh, um, co op uh, movie again. You know? Yeah. So I didn't think it was going to do well. Um, now Dark Phoenix, I thought it was going to do better than it did. Just because it's an X Men movie, uh-huh. I think that's that was the um, that um, that's what they was banking on. It's X Men movie. Uh, go watch it's X Men movie. Yeah, they thought that too, and it didn't work out. Yes, so uh, it's nothing to really say. I mean, these trash movies if they're not gonna work out, if it's not gonna work together, it's stop making these movies, man. Stop making them. Stop making them. Um, that's a problem now. About Shaft, I feel sorry for Shaft if these other movies is getting money, um, and Shaft is is a good movie and is not getting the money that is deserved. They they people need to really stand up for this man. Mm-hmm. That's why we're here on Jody's Corner to stand up for these uh, tr- uh, good movies and wreck the bad ones, right? Mm-hmm. But but Shaft never really made any money. Like like even even the previous ones, even though like there was. Way back when. It, 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 but but it made it made it, it never made in the hundreds, you know, like maybe Shaft two thousand did. Yeah, maybe. And then the original one that was kind of a different time period, but yeah, yeah, the yeah. exploitation genre kind of yeah, same. Maybe how Shaft two thousand did, bro. That, maybe, it yeah, was kind yeah. of like needed because they were just they were putting out little action movies here and there, and we were the leads, and it was a predominantly all black cast, so right. it, was, it was different, man. It was a different time. Okay, yeah, and because right. Hollywood was kind of bankruptcy around that time, and especially the year, stuff, so yeah. that genre kind of saved it. Mm-hmm. Shaft two thousand, okay, yeah. got you seventy million. Hmm, seventy. That's, yeah, pretty that's, really that's pretty good. That's really good. That's pretty good. That's really good. For, for, for a movie like that, yeah. that is great. That's yeah, great, you know that's saying? great. But the star power in there, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, Samuel mm-hmm. Jackson. Mm-hmm. Yeah, $70 million. That's pretty good. That was, that was like this film won't see thing, $70 man. million, though. No. You see by the way it's going, it might, might see 40 45 If but, that. But but it has, it has a lot of uh, uh, competition around it. Like, it, yeah. it's a lot of. But it, like, it's also different, though. You got a lot working in like your Like, Ma. Favor. Ma had competition with Godzilla. Right, right. She still cleaned house. Yeah. And Aladdin. She cleaned house because of the demographic black people, mothers, horror. So, all that Thriller. helped it out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then Blumhouse stays true to their strategy all the time. They make their movies for little and they make, they make even, they make it all back. So, it's cool. And then, uh, as far as like the. When he was talking about the 2000 Shaft. You had a lot of stuff kind of working in your favor. You know, you had John Singleton doing it, then you had his right. star power, and then mm-hmm. what he brings yeah. to it, and then the cast that he ensembled together. Christian Bale, 
Kai Fight, everybody's in there. You know yes. what I'm saying? So you got people you like and want to yes. see, diverse, and then you got Singleton's doing it too. All right, uh, I kind of figure. All right, I'm in. You know what I'm saying? Here it's kind of like uh, directed, not so much. But Sam Jackson's here, but Richard Rounds is here. You relying on star power now, but everything else ain't really lining up. You know what I mean? What well, he said it was a surprise. I haven't seen. Him was that yet. kid annoying? But I'm just going off of what he has said. You know, the, what kid are you talking about? The joke. The the, the, the just Usher. The young. Uh, just the young Usher. Just, yeah. Yeah. just yeah. as trash as I thought he was going to okay. be. Okay. Yeah. He's what? he. N- I don't understand how he's getting Hollywood work. But no justice. He, he, huh? he has family what, in Hollywood, bro. How's everybody else though in the movie? Everybody what? else was good. Oh, okay, he was the, the, the same, uh, the, same the same guy so that that, that was in a uh, in Independence Day. Day. Yeah, right. He, he can't, can't act for nothing. He shouldn't. He can't. He can't act for seeing nothing. Seeing him in Hollywood, man, in that Christmas movie. His daddy Garbage. is a producer or something. <laughs> his uncle is someone tied in somewhere. Oh, he's giving up. He's that juiced hole. in, bro. Uh, he is cute too, man. He's giving it. Man, up. there's a lot more cuter black dudes out there, bro. You could have <laughs> cast. You could have cast Michael B. Jordan in the same role and made this movie twice as good, bro. He's kind of older though. Uh, kind of uh, older. Wait, 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 wait. wait. I, we should never got a young chef like Michael B. Jordan's the right appropriate age. Yeah, that okay. would have been a complete different movie. What the heck? And Look at might, that age it gap. Been a lot more gritty. Richard Roundtree's like 73. Yeah. Samuel Jackson 70. Yeah. But he's his daddy. <laughs> it, it's crazy. So when you, if you're going to do generation, at least get somebody for us. You That's know what crazy, bro. Yeah. All right, man. Let's move on. Donation, man. Christian Black donated $5 to us. Thank you, Christian. <laughs> I appreciate you. You said, what's up, Lee? Yeah. Yeah. What's shot wedding, homie? With the crash and burn of Dark Phoenix, do you think Disney is going to let New Mutants by Fox drop? Oh, I have the answer to that one. Uh, HC3, what do you think? Read it again. With... Uh, Fox crashing and burning and Disney buying them will dark will uh um new Disney. mutants come out. It, it's new mutants it's gonna be It was a the, Fox title yeah, that yeah. has been pushed back like many times. Many times, yeah. So so will what, Disney what release be, oh, okay, okay. Fox's New Mutants. Nah. Okay. That, that, they're like a horror trying to try to make it like a yeah, horror. But thing. No, no. Was, Flash. I don't think so. I don't think so. No, Ronin. No. Uh I'll think a little bit different. I think they might. Cause they they, what? they gotta switch it up. I've been saying it's this Disney, bro. Yeah, I, they own everything, right? They, that looks like horror. It's it 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 a horror, horror bro. It was like a rated R you horror. Can't say yes. no competition with yourself, bro. If they, they it's not they just gotta, Disney though. They gotta do something different. It's not just the Warner Brothers out there. They're, they're the look, monopoly. Look, look, we, look, we look, look it, They're not quite they, a monopoly. If they do do it, if they do do it, they have everything, bro. Like they have everything. They gotta switch it up. They have a lot. They don't have everything. They gotta switch it up. If they do do it, that's what I'm saying. It would put it to a uh, uh, PG thirteen. It would be a trash but film. Then it we'll was PG thirteen already. Then, then Fox said, "Let's make an R, reshoot it to death, then they push have it back." To switch it up. They needed to go uh, to to be rated R because because the way the trailers portrayed it, it. If they don't change their strategy, we're gonna go right back to square one of things that we did not want to see in previous phases. Bro, they th- gotta switch it up. They're not going dark. I'm not saying that they're going. This is not going. Just, I'm thinking how they have to change it. So you think Ronan that Disney will put it in theaters? I think so. I'm, so, yeah, so, yeah, I'm so speculating. You, you think all right. you you want them to I try to, to save it. the X Men their X Men franchise? No, 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 no. no. He wanted uh, he wanted out because he's a horror based <laughs> he's that a horror based fan. That too. He loves yeah, horror. Yeah, 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 that's, that's, that's what it is. There we go. He admits it. Hey, bias. What that horror? But I know they gotta do it. You're a fan too. I am. I am. Oh, yeah, but you, but you, oh! Oh! Ventus Gang! Lord! Ventus Gate dropped a hundred dollars on us live on Jody's Corner. Oh, Kage. Oh, Kage. Oh, little leakage. Ventus Gate. This is a new name I've new. never seen before. Right. This is a new subscriber, yeah. Yeah. a new, new donation, first timer, they knew. and in the hundred dollar club. <laughs> they knew. Ventus Gate. Congratulations, Ventus Gate. He says, I love your videos, guys. I was wondering if you would check out a quick video. It would make me so happy if you guys would check it out. It's less than a minute. It's called Ricardo Milos, the seventh Hokage. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. That Uh, is if the link don't work. um, Now, just to let you know, Hokage. Anime. Ho- yeah, Naruto, anime. right? And Naruto, Hokage Naruto. is the top. It's like the the president of the village, for sure. Okay. Yeah, we'll definitely do that for you then. Uh, yeah, we can do that for you. Less than a minute. Check it out. Um, Got you. And it also it's not spelled Hokage. It's H O K A G E. Yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. Uh, they did that so I could read it. 
So I could sound it out and read it. Nah, I think no, nah, he is fun of the video. They making yeah. fun of Hokage gay. Yeah, like it's gay. Yeah. Then when you see something gay, <laughs> I'm down to see something gay. <laughs> yeah, they making fun of it, bro. Oh, I'm definitely down to see some some gay stuff for <laughs> sure. Actually, we'll do it after this topic. We'll for do sure, it after this topic, sure. which is about to end. So the sit tight, so man. We, sit tight, Ventus. You. Sit tight, Ventus. In about 15 minutes or so. All right, thank you. Whoa, that was nice. Uh, <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'm gonna say no for Christian Black. They will not release New Mutants in the theaters, they won't but it might come to the streaming service. I did hear something about that. Hulu. It might come to the streaming on, service. Hulu? Yeah, but put on Hulu. Put on Hulu. They're releasing it. I love Hulu. Not on their Disney Plus. Put yeah. that sheet on Hulu. They own that too. So it's fine. Uh, that's where Ghost Rider and them is going. So if I'm not mistaken, we'll Marvel it. is still dropping stuff on Hulu, right? Yeah. yeah. I think Marvel, Disney Pictures will release Disney stuff there. They'll release rated R stuff on through Fox mm -hmm. for film. Mm -hmm. For streaming, Disney Plus for their Disney stuff. Right. For their mature rated, Hulu. Hulu. There it mm -hmm. is. They have a G rated and an R rated platform on streaming mm -hmm. and in actual production companies mm -hmm. for theaters, bro. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're, 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 Don't they're, you want that? They're doing that. Of course you do. They're making yeah. it happen. Yeah, of course you do. <laughs> yeah. All right. Tim Fabro gave us $10. Shout out to Tim Fabro. Timmy. Timmy says, uh, just to the us to the league. So with happy money and post Father's Day. Oh yeah. And Jay, Toronto is going crazy right now. Two million people waiting for the Raptors to get to the city square. The parade. The parade. Oh, the, the the parade. parade. The parade. oh two million people? Oh, hey. for sure. Uh four million in LA, my dude. Hey. Like four million out there when Sha Ka Shaq and Kobe, bro. Man, hey, I, hey, I hate hey, that. Man. It was traffic Kawhi? everywhere, man. Bro, oh, man. Kawhi uh, gonna be there too. Yeah, oh, sure. he'll be there as soon as the parade's yeah. over. He will catch a plane to L.A. to Tar sign a deal. Okay, sure. <laughs> <Yeah>. Wow. <laughs> uh, uh, are we at Are we at Maple Street yet? Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let me see. Yeah, so that's it for that. Uh, as far as this this box office thing goes, this is gonna lead me into my next topic that I had planned, but we're gonna do a little hybrid and uh, react to uh, what he wants. What is it? What's it called again? Because uh, he didn't put a link I don't, down. I remember the, the mod's got to put a link. Yeah, you got to put a link down. But Ricardo it's called Milos. Ricardo Milos, the seventh Hokage. Ricardo Milos, and the seventh Hokage. All right, so we will be right back after this promotion. Check this out, guys. Come see us on Friday. See us on Friday. See us on Friday. See us on Friday. And we are back it's with like a, Ricardo like, Milos, the seventh the, Hokage. We're calling it a meme. I have no idea. This was a hundred dollar donation request live. Let's do it. What the hell are you doing here? Oh, bro's gay. This is gay. Oh. Oh. Bruh. The boy next door. At the other end, Kobe, look out as he rises and scores. <laughs> that turns me off. Kobe, take it all the way.
That was gay as a motherfucker, bro. Bruh. That's some gay shit, bro. Bro, look at Bobo. Y'all take it easy, <laughs> bro. <Bruh. Whew. laughs> bro. Bro. What did I just say? What the freak, bro? <laughs> I want to go home, bro. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what the actual oh. freak? <laughs> I want to go home. What <laughs> the freak, bro? <laughs> Oh my god, <laughs> bro! <Bruh. laughs> this wow. dude, what 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 got me through that whole video Destroyed. was when he took <laughs> took his dick in that freaking thong, and <laughs> twisted his dick to make a freaking resengan. <laughs> he made a resengan off the twist of his dick, uh, Bruh uh, that resengan was serious. You. <laughs> Freak is a resend gun. R- Imagine R- in my position. All I'm seeing is gay. Gay. <laughs> yeah. No ties Talk. to nothing. I don't know. None of them animes. No it's just uh, gay, bro. Uh, uh, R- Rise of Gun is a technique that Naruto's father created with a, um with with the wind. Um and it's uh with sh- the uh, wind. <laughs> with it's uh shakira. Which the f- is the inner the freak is the, a shakira. His inner kai. Basically. All right, thank Ch- you. Thank Inner you. Power. Okay. Chakra. Right. It's like a uh, 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 a key. Yeah, that's what Dragon Ball Z. For sure. Yeah, for for sure. Sure. Got it. But uh, my Good Lord. And that was that. I mean, was that uh? That was Madara, uh, man. Madara. <laughs> <laughs> my right. thing is, he just appeared out of nowhere. Did it? Did it? Did it just appeared on his head? <laughs> what? <laughs> what did I just? Hey, say? hey, 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 hey! Both thongs and everything, bro. Uh, uh, Bobo, come come back, man. Hey, <laughs> hey, Bobo. Hope you hearing me right now. We gonna set a date, you and me, Bobo. We gonna set a date. We doing everything sport related. We gonna set a date. I challenge you, homeboy. Mm, is that a challenge? Yeah, challenge. Uh, hey, might take me a month, two months, might be next year. Who knows? But we gonna do. A running challenge, a pull-up challenge, a push-up challenge, everything. Athletic. I'm coming for you, Bubble. Uh-huh. I'm here, baby. But we haven't seen, we, we only seen Bubble just sitting in the chair. We just I know, I know he don't cuss, man. Uh, honestly, I don't, I don't think he, he can do push-ups. He don't cuss. And I haven't seen you do push-ups <laughs> either. Freak? Huh? I, I know, I, I, I have. I, I, I've done plenty. Okay. Um, <laughs> Latoria Bosley donated five dollars. Hey, Latoria says it's been a while since I could catch you guys live. Keep up the great work. Hashtag Black Owned. <laughs> you god dang straight. Thank mm-hmm. you, Latoria. I appreciate you. <clears throat> hey, it's always good to stay busy. You know, if you're busy, then uh, hey, I am. Yeah, I ain't knocking it. Legend of Old one on one five dollars. Shout to Legend of Old. Man. He says I'm dead. That Hokage video is mad. <laughs> it's mad. <laughs> that video, that video was a lot, bro. Yeah, that, that was that was and, that and, was and, a and, lot. And, and us, and us knowing Naruto, you know Naruto. No, no. Us knowing Naruto, it, it was more. It's a lot of filler in that show. It, 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 it was more <laughs> weird because we we knew all the characters, but they just turned gay on us. Oh my, it's crazy. I played that Jump Force though. It's pretty fun. Jump yeah. Force. Yeah, all yeah, right, so we're gonna. Cool. Move on to topics, man. Uh, yes, sir. That was that was uh, gay. That was gay. Yeah, that was that was shout gay. That was gay. Rotation. Uh, shout out donation. Yeah. Shout out to hundred though. Yeah, yeah hundred. Shout out. Shout out, it was, it was shout out for 100. that that, yeah. that, that cock rotation. That. <laughs> that was the gayest part. That was, he, good lord. <laughs> I'm done. Uh, I'm dead. Oh man, she was big too. Though. I thought I thought All you right, would like uh, the. <laughs> Let's go ahead and move on. Maybe we were talking about um, the box office, right? Oh, Lord. We were talking about the weekend box office blenders. We were talking about how these films keep coming out. These franchises, this Godzilla, and not doing good, Men in Black, and Aladdin, whatever you want to call it, you know, Shaft, Ma, all the other stuff. You know, the box office just isn't really doing good. I think that might be for a different reason than the question that I actually have, or maybe it's this. Maybe it's maybe this question is irrelevant. Maybe maybe I am a madman, and I'm just uh, in he's my mad. head too he's much. Mad. 
And I just need to just go ahead and just let it go and be quiet and just let Hollywood do what they're doing. But the question that I have, are audiences getting dumber? Mm. Are movie audiences getting dumber? I think about Thor Ragnarok. I think about Ant-Man and the Wasp. I think about Captain Marvel. I think about Infinity War. I think about Endgame, even though I love it. I think about movies like that. I think about Men in Black. I think about Godzilla. But Godzilla's kind of different because it's like of a campy. I think about a lot of film Transformers. There's so many films that are just trash that audiences... People in the norm, people, GP, who believe and don't see these movies being bad. Now, that's my opinion on those type of films. Uh, There's a plethora of bad movies that people love. Ghostbusters 2016. You know what I'm saying? Suicide Squad. PBS. Don't put Suicide Squad in this, homie. Bruh. What you trying to say? Was, I'm trying that was to say, a good I'm, movie. I'm saying Suicide Squad's a bad movie and, and, and people trying to defend the, the, it. The, 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 first, the uh, first 10 minutes was pure fire. Yes, it was. And Thank the, you. The first 30 minutes was fire. Okay. The, See? The okay, let's go. But how okay. long is the movie? <laughs> Wait, huh? Huh? How, how long is the movie, the movie though? Huh? You said the movie was tired. <laughs> what? <laughs> so that's the question I'm asking for the chat. I'm asking it for the people who are listening to the Jody's Corner podcast right now <laughs> on Spotify. Well, not right now. Yeah, right oh, now. Okay. On Spotify, iTunes, and Google Music. I'm asking the panel. I want to know. I really believe this. I believe movie audience is getting dumber. Ishtar says, I don't think it's dumber. I think they're more focused on the hype and not the substance. Real film lovers out there, mostly from our generation and before us. So she says, focus on hype and not the substance. Like, for instance, let's use Spider-Man. Far from home, let's go see it. I get that's why people go see it for hype. Mm-hmm. Then the substance is once you see it, what you think about it. So, Ishtar, if it was hype, that explains box office numbers. But it doesn't explain how they think the film is good. That's right. where the substance comes into gotcha. play. Yeah. So, these people who are going for hype, which I agree, Ishtar, but they're also going for substance because they're saying it's substance. They're saying films like Infinity War make sense and are great, Men in Black. There are people who think this is a good movie. A lot of people. Oh, that movie was good. I love the action. I love the I love the guns, the weapons. I love their chemistry together. It was I, awesome. It was I, funny. I see I see I seen one person on Facebook that said that Dark Phoenix, I kid you not, only for trolling, but he seemed very serious. That Dark Phoenix was the best of the franchise. Wow. Almost threw up in so, my mouth. See what I'm saying? And That's real though, Ronan. That's and, real. And he was defending it, That's like, yes. like, like I, with his I, life. I saw yes. It on Facebook. I don't know if it was the same person you saw, but I was like, what? It happened because it probably, said, it probably was me, one person. Let me not get up in this chat because right, we're we'll, <laughs> we'll about to go to war. See, look, something. there's people in the chat. Yeah. JJ Smooth, leave Infinity War alone. He's one of them. Look at uh, France Gordet. BVS was a masterpiece. You see what I'm saying? Oh yes. It's real, bro. People will fight you. They'll for these trash movies, man. And I'm not talking that's about not a, a bad thing. That's though. opinion. Like, that's, that's, good, talking, that's good stuff, though. I'm not talking about just opinion based. Oh, yeah. I didn't like it. Yeah. That's you could never. That's never universally right or wrong. What is universally right or wrong is how a script is written, the direction, right. cohesiveness, right. performances, uh, the yeah. performances, and all that stuff is what I'm right. talking about. Why I think Infinity War and BVS are bad movies. Gotcha. It's a coincidence because I think those are both the same for their universes. BVS ruined DC, and I think Infinity War ruined Marvel. So. Oh, there you go. dang. That's going too far right there. Ruin Marvel. Yeah, yeah I, I think know. so. I think I think Infinity War, it tore down what the MCU was built on. <clears throat> Everything that gassed up when you got to Infinity War, none of the characters were like what you saw. Now, this goes back to what I was, good segue, this goes back to what I was saying about the last topic we were saying. They got to switch it up. They have to switch it. They have if you repeat the same thing, we're going to go back to square one. They yeah. got to change they it. They can't. They mm. can't. They cannot stay kid friendly. DC's forever. doing they it. Can. They're switching it up because they failed. They but fell they flat the, on their they face. They have the characters to do it. And yeah, and, and they haven't even blew their load. You feel what I'm saying? They haven't even blew Superman. The they haven't really blew Batman or Wonder Woman. You got Green Lantern, Flash out there, bruh. 
They have so much longevity to go. I'm They're about to come Marvel out with new Marvel blew guns. their load, and they like, can't redo it over. They got to change it. I hope to. they change it. But it looks what they're, what they're changing it to is some SJW shit, which ain't good. Because both of these motherfuckers on my screen, that's why I left them up there. Tessa and Thor, <laughs> uh, Valkyrie and Thor, they're the future of the MCU, bro. Personally to me, I don't care to see his freaking face anymore in MCU. I don't ever uh, want to see him again. Hey, I want I want I want to say Thor is is the future. I'll I'll say Tessa more more than Thor, Thor is the future. and the Guardians of the Galaxy, bro. Um, that Thor. is they're not the future. That's the future of the MCU. Chris, Chris. Space is not the future. Chris, Thor is not the future. Thor's got like how, how many uh, uh, movies left? He got on his contract. I'm glad you asked me. None, this. none. Okay, it's none, right. none. Yeah, Actually, uh, it was uh, it was said. I remember when Thor after Thor Dark World, after Ultron. Chris Hemsworth was upset with Marvel, and he was going to leave and stop playing Thor. He was on his way out. You know, he liked mm. the serious. He liked the take and all that. But once Taika Waititi got, when they changed Thor Ragnarok and reshot yeah. it and took Joss Whedon's, and they turned Thor Ragnarok into a joke, mm -hmm. and Thor was cracking jokes, he says, if you make Thor more like this jokey, I'll stay. Oh, you know And in Infinity War and in Ragnarok, what they do in Ragnarok? Teamed him up with the Guardians of the Galaxy. As Guardians of the Galaxy. Off we go. Endgame. In Endgame. Yeah. I'm the captain. No, yes. no. Cracking jokes. All the way to... Bruh, they're about to go on an adventure in Guardians 3. That's a real thing. You think that was just for that movie? <clears throat> Bet Thor is in Guardians of the Galaxy 3. Of course he is, but you're saying the future. Yeah, he's the That's future. just one movie. He ain't going nowhere. Yeah, Chris. Well, Chris said. Hey, how Chris many said, Guardians? Did and nah, but Chris said that uh, you, you could, he's, he could do as many Thor's that he's want. He don't want to be. Wow. He don't want to stop being well, Thor. So long as it's so long as it's comedic. If they he's staying. Thor, is going. He's going to be. That doesn't Whoa. make any sense. That's contradictory to the whole. It's, it's a new team, though, right? What like new he's, team? He's part of it. Uh, well, you said they. Well, he they, moved to the Guardians. Yes. No, no, no. I mean, like. The future of the phases, like there's uh, a whole nother squad, right? Like everybody else is out. Oh right? no, no, because we have uh, Black Panthers coming back, mm -hmm. Spider Man's coming back, mm -hmm. Thor's coming back, and then that's it, right? Uh, Hulk is coming back. I Hulk, thought he, I thought he was done. Mark Ruffalo has like four more movies on his contract. He has no character though. He just, he didn't do anything in what the bro, last three, four after movies? after the first Avengers. I think he signed like a six movie deal, bro, or seven movie deal. Cameos, and he he ain't there yet. He was in Ultron. Ragnarok, Infinity War, and so, Endgame. So those are three people that are back. Yeah, it's gonna be a brand new team. Captain Marvel, she's adding. She's mm -hmm. gonna be out too. Once that she ain't work. out, she's the future, my dude. She's the future. She got like six ah, movies. She's the future. They they they're pushing her to be the future, but it's not gonna happen. Work okay, gets out, they think, gonna stop her. Okay, you think it's gonna stop? Yeah, they gonna stop her. Uh, uh, she's uh, already got a negative. Doctor Strange is still right around. Now. Correct. Doctor Strange, Strange he, is still around. Doctor Strange is fine. But Captain Marvel Thor. will be the captain. Who's yeah. the leader of the new oh, Avengers? Oh, don't say that. Who who you think, Ronan? Yeah. Who's the Iron Man? I don't, I don't want to believe it. Just, Who's uh, the Cap? Captain Marvel is the... Captain Marvel is, is, is replacing uh, Captain America, bro. In Avengers, yeah. They, it, it, ahead of no. Kevin Feige even said that. Like, uh, yeah! Like, they, they, they're, Kevin they're Feige gearing, on his way out, too. So they, when he says... They're, 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 gearing, <laughs> they're gearing her towards... I was hoping he was out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're gearing her to be to be the leader. And she she uh, is. Hey, 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 look. No. The way, the way she acted in Endgame, I wouldn't mind it. I mean, she had, she she did okay in the game. Like, okay. She didn't have a bad uh, performance. She she showed uh, leadership, you know, in my eyes. What's that? Why are you talking about Captain Marvel? That yeah. default leadership? I mean, not not she, really, though. That's, so we're talking about dumb audiences. We got to put dumb people up here. So, uh, yeah. You know. yeah, 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 yeah. Now but, we're on dumb but, but audiences. Back, dumb back, audiences. Dumb people, right? But, but back to that, man. Like, I feel dumber. Back, back to the uh, original question. You know, we kind of you know, straight off a little bit. That's what we do. You know, it's oh, yeah. tight. Yeah. Uh, I feel that it 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 depends. Like like you said earlier, it depends on 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 what you said. Like, is it is it the hype? It's, it's, you know, hype. because because a lot of dumb movies do get money, but a lot of them don't. A lot of them suck. You know, a lot of them don't don't get the audience approval. Like Dark Phoenix. That was a terrible uh, film, but but. But why do you think it was terrible? The, the acting, the plot, the the the. What, what, the, was, the, what was the last no, movie that came before that? Yeah, that too. What was uh, the last apocalypse, movie that came apocalypse. Logan. Oh, okay, Logan, Logan. That was it. They should just walked away and took the W. Why would you make? That was a good film Deadpool though. Two after Logan. You know what I mean? 
Deadpool was uh, that we were promised that Logan was a, a good film though. Ago, we were supposed to get Dark Phoenix. Logan was and a good film. And then they tried to recreate that and do it again. They were banking off that name. That's what it was, and they knew they were about to lose them rights because MC was about to come in and get it and really do it. Uh, That's why we got Dark Phoenix. They was like, all right, we got one more. We got one more. Let's do it. Let's that little it petition there. ain't gonna do anything. It's just yeah. a and, 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 and we got we we got the same story that that we got pretty much in uh, the Last Stand. Yeah. Like the Dark Phoenix story. Like, yeah, wait a minute, hold on, CJP. He says again, the audiences aren't dumb. If there's something in the movie that fascinates them, then folks will watch. So if there's something that fast, so if they make a movie about a bouncing ball and it makes a hundred million dollars in the theater, they're not dumb. That's yeah. the that's that's mentally retarded. That must be a. Good it's not about <laughs> jumping ball. That's the equivalent. Of that's the movies. problem. You see what he said. As long as it's something that fascinates me. It could be a trash movie that fascinates me. I have seen trash movies and have been fascinated by them. That comment right there is proof that audiences are getting dumber. But he not, to, not to shout you out personally, but that thinking that so long as you're fascinated, you should go watch the movie and, and rep the yeah, movie. That's, that's, that's the problem. Bro, that's, that's bro the Pootie Tang is fascinating. Oh, it's wow. stupid. Oh, my God. It's a trash movie. I can name another. There's tons of fascinating bad trash movies. People, people, people don't have the the. I won't say the the the, the knowledge, or but they don't have attention the attention span. Attention. No, 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 no. They don't have the two the two movie. They don't have the the critic and the fan. Sometimes it, it just be the fan that that Even goes to the movie. Fan though, I'm a fan of X Men. That she trash. No, it's like okay, like like uh, can't support Hobbs and Shaw. When we go see Hobbs and Shaw, we going we gonna have to turn our brains off because it's gonna be just minus no, action. No, I'm not, no, 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 that looks no, that, no. that that is an bro, action. That bro, is a, they're going back to his homeland and doing all the freaking uh, 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 Samoan dance. That that's culture, that, baby. Then you gotta wreck it. That but but that's not supposed to be in some in a in a in in a movie like this. He that's brought he nice, brought he brought he brought that with him. That's you know homage what I mean? to classic campy action films. Action films in the '90s started off that way, that cheesy, nice. campy, over the top. <clears throat> I don't say it's gonna be a good in film. In True Lies, I, a man on that. a plane attached to a missile got fired into a building, throughout the other side, into a helicopter, and blew it up. That was tight. I know, but it's <laughs> ridiculous. That could happen. That, no, that missile would have fell. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, wait, wait, no, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't try to discredit True Lies, my G. True Lies is. Epic it's, because it's epic. You, you understand those type of things. It's epic. How is Arnold Schwarzenegger half drunk from Truth Serum blow up an entire camp with two hundred people in it? How does it, one man? It, how does it, one man? It wore off. <laughs> how does one man? It wore off fast. Manage to kill an entire camp with <laughs> hundreds of people in it. <laughs> she dropped the gun down the ramp and the gun spun and killed every henchman. Oh, it did do that. It did do that. Down the stairs, right? <laughs> Prime time, Jamie Lee. <laughs> By the time the gun starts spinning, nothing but bodies on the ground, bro. All dead. Nothing but bodies dead. They're all dead. <laughs> oh, I forgot about that. They are gone. I did, I did, I did too. Bro. That's uh, what you get with those type of action movies. That's a genre in itself. It's tropes. That's what we wanted. That's what we expected. That's how it it was bruh, birthed bruh, that way. Bro, bro, the way the way Hobbs and Shaw look, there you you Hobbs can't compare a great action movie, bro. Wait, are you trying to compare Hobbs and Shaw to? Is that to a Trump lie? face? Is that your Trump face? Like, no, 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 no. That's, that's a, 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 make America that's a great again. Uh, uh, a joker face when we set the table. <laughs> hey, 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 listen here. Hey, How it's gone. Oh, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Joker face. Hey, all right, hey, are you trying to compare those two? I mean, like, like, oh, no, no, no. Jody, are you trying to compare those two? Yeah, I'm comparing them. Oh, heck no. Are you serious, bro? Let, let me tell you something right now. That's some over the top crazy. They got. Uh, uh, running it. down friggin' uh, uh, <laughs> buildings, bro. That uh, 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 Edrum, uh, uh, um, Edrum, he is running down the side of a building with no rope. They were having a he wrestling has, match on he has top no rope. of an F1 fighter hovering in midair. <laughs> they were suplexing <laughs> each other, bro. That, <laughs> get, oh, 
That could have happened. That ain't happening, uh, bro. Uh, bro, 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 bro. Uh, it, it was oh it was just hovering. Nah, it wasn't flying nowhere. It was uh, just hovering. hovering. Yeah, it was hovering, bro. And there was, was a hovering. wrestling match. Come bro, on, oh come my on, man. God, come man. On, man. Jesus Christ. Come on, man. Hold on. Are you I'm really? Not, look, I'm not done, but there's look, a level look, of over the top action. Like you, you know it exists, right? You knew it exists back in the day. Like this is not a new thing. Right. It's the it's same not. thing. I agree. But this. You, well, you, I think no, no, you no, kind no, of no, you no, said no, you said no, turn no, your for brain me, off. For me, no, for me, we have to acknowledge it. That's the fun part about it. For me, this this is most over the top action film. A trailer. Have it. The trailer. No, no, no. Trailer. The trailer is from. From beginning to end is nonstop over the top action. All the fast and furious. Over the fast and furious. Over, over that fast them. eight and that fast seven. Those are ridiculous. Planes coming out of a hangar with parachutes. The rocks controlling the missile. How on you ice. know you gonna land on bro, ground, bro? How? Bro, you cars, bro, you mean? Bro, and no, and no, and no. In those film, in those film, it, 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 it was one or two, time. maybe, maybe a few scenes like that. Yeah, but this Hobbs and Shaw seems like it's gonna be number that a few nonstop. Scenes, a few yes. scenes. Here's the most ridiculous thing from Fast and the Furious. When a 100-mile-per-hour car is going on one side of the freeway and another 100-mile-per-hour coming, that's 200-some miles per hour of impact. And Vin Diesel jumps from one car to another, catches Letty midair, and crashes on the other side in a windshield and gets no arm. The, the car got broke. And Vin he Diesel stomped fine. a freaking parking lot to the ground. He Hulk smashed and imploded a parking lot. La, 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 la. In Fast and the Furious 7, a car from a building in Dubai ran out the top into another building and parked on the inside, bruh. <laughs> it's cartoon. What? It's cartoon. The freak are you talking about? It's cartoon. Hobbs and Shaw looks fantastic, bro. Yeah. Let us to me. If you wreck I, them all, I, then I'm you're going to wreck I, Fast and Furious. If you're going to wreck Hobbs and Shaw, wreck the Fast and Furious movie. Yes. Wait, wait, the franchise wait, as well. Wait, Fast I, I, Five, never, they drug the cartoon. They drug the I've never the defended the, uh, the Fast Furious besides, besides one and two. You like two, five? You like five? The five is the best one. Five is cool. Five is cool, but but they all but once you get past past a uh, uh, fast like four, I like five and six. Fa fast four, that's when that crap get over the top, bro. And I didn't like six it. Six had the best villain though. I, I like six because of the villain. And this the is what I'm saying. It was like Hobbs and Shaw looks to be an A action movie, an A. Because it's going back to basics. It looks like all it's gonna have easy. action. It looks like it's gonna be mm -hmm. funny. Mm -hmm. It looks like it's gonna that, go over that, the top that, that, and, and be just awesome and get your and adrenaline pumping. Two of the best characters in the it, fast franchise. It, when they came in, they made it better. Right. Hobbs yeah. was the and reason. They, they're going elevated. to give us what we want: martial arts and explosions. And fight. have you seen Crank High Voltage? No. <sighs> oh man, that was <laughs> 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 over the top. <laughs> that was over the bro. top too. Over the top, bro. <laughs> Not the best movie, bro. But I, I bro, like <laughs> there's some really. That's the action genre. It just goes. It's just out there. It's you don't awesome. need to make sense. You can't make sense of an action film. They're nonsensical, but that's the thing. They're good. That, that like there's that some smart way. ones though. But yeah, I heard you saying there's a no, genre, there's a genre for the ridiculous uh, over the top. There's smart Thank ones. You. But Thank the, you. They're, they're, but the smart ones. Hold on. 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 All right. So you tell me. There are smart action films in there, but there's subgenres as well. It's not yeah, just yeah. it's not a pure action. It's an action thriller. It'll yeah, be an yeah. action suspense. Facts, facts. So you're adding in another genre to it. I'm talking yeah. about a pure action film. This I'm with you. Be I'm like, there's different levels of it. It's, yeah. I think this is action sci-fi. This bro. is action sci-fi. He, think said, he said he was Black Superman. That that's clearly sci-fi. <laughs> <laughs> right there. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm yeah, I'm with you. I'm with yeah, you. yeah. So there's there's a level of it. It's different. Like my man said, you that's want realism. Okay, Die Hard, something like Long Kiss yeah, Goodnight. Or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you that. want over the top crank. You know what? Uh, Fast and Furious. There's two genres that don't what? need to be make sense: action and comedy. Those are the ones yeah. where my man's comment has some relevance. And then you I got said, just be fascinated. Like that. That's action and comedy. Those are the only two genres you could really get away with being a stupid movie and loving it. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> those are those are genres that are. Purely based on emotion and feel. I want to make you laugh. As long as I make you laugh, that's what you're here for, right? I want to make your eyes bleed because of the spectacle. I want to make you you tremble in your seat because of this action. I want you to feel some type of way. Bruh, look, when I when I go see Hobbs and Shaw, I'm not I'm not I'm not going to when I say turn your brain off, I'm not I'm not going to look for 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 a good story. Right. That's what I mean. I'm not. I'm not going to. Oh, this, this yes. is probably gonna be fantastic. Action is so, not so, about the story. Action, so that's right. what. No, no, no. But some action is. Some action yeah, do have. 
good it's story. Like one of those, uh, uh, the, the, the films. It, 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 it's like you finna go there just to look at Miles' action. No, I don't no, think, no, you're not. No, are you saying Transformers? Is that what you're saying? This is gonna be that's my that's Miles. That's Miles too. Yeah, th- this is not gonna have Transformers story. This will have a much better story than Transformers. This, this is about to have a kitty story, bro. It's superhero. It's a bad guy villain who's trying to take over the world. I gotta beat you. Yes. That's it's it's not so trash. You it's, gotta, re, it's rehash, but you, not trash. You you gotta leave your 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 brain on for that? Leave I don't it. think so. Leave your what? Your brain on for that? I don't think so. You go to your brain off and just, it just watch action, bro. It could be smart. Look it's smart. Bro, fast uh, Fate of the Furious, the eighth one, had some smarts in there. It did? Yeah. How they used, uh, how they they tricked you about the brothers, about who the mother was, Statham, and thought he was dead, and he came back, and then he did the airplane scene, he saved Dom's child. That was nice, man. That was a nice little twist. They thought he was dead throughout most of the film, and they showed you how they faked the death, low key, blah blah blah. That's and then in fast, and then fast uh, six, was it? Lady's death, how that wasn't a real thing. Yeah, they yeah. Kinda, that was good. That, that was kinda, good. That was, yeah, yeah, they kind of put a little, they, they, they the put twist. A little, they trying okay. to put a little something in there. Oh, she betrayed the group and all that. Yeah, yeah, was, yeah, was, yeah, yeah. Some yeah. good stuff in there. Do you remember her face? Because I don't. <laughs> Do you remember her face? Because I don't. Last time I saw it was burning. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Buster. <laughs> who uses nitro in her car? You looked under my hood? Huh? Gran Torino, four tires. Some... Something, her name was Letty or something. I wrecked her car. Now what? <laughs> Do you remember her face? Because I don't. Last time I saw her was burning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Shout out to that fast, that fast foe, bro. Wow. Now what? Little tear in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy Spectacle. what happens next. Yeah, Furious give you a little bit of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Furious give you a little bit of it. Fast, that, it that, that, fast four. That's my second favorite one behind five. Four was was is really my personal favorite. Yeah, but I give why though. It's just so deep. It's deep. It was deep. It great story. That's a great story. It Fast got, Four was fire, bro. It got more into the detective factor. Yeah, yeah. Fast yeah. and Furious. That fourth one was really, really. Good. That was that was the last well told film for Fast. It was really uh, good, yeah. man. I like the. Uh, yeah, I think that's when Paul Walker kind of switched it up a little bit. He started going more detective. It was more like yeah, it was, like it was really basics, good. Fast criminals. Four was really good, y'all. Yeah. You still had your racing in there. You know what I'm saying? There was still logic in there. It was, yeah. but there was a little detective in there. Yeah, yeah. Fast Four was tight. Five came in. G.I. Joe, over the top, 18. It was just, it got yeah. really ridiculous. The, uh, the previous G.I. Joe. Yeah. Yeah. G.I. Joe, another trash action film. <laughs> trash. <laughs> trash action over franchise. The, uh, over the top over trash the action film. Uh, Marlon Wayans. Marlon Oh, uh, golly. But yeah, yeah, man. Uh, so answer the question. Decent, answer the question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I, elaborate on what you think. Are they dumber? Are, audi- are movie audiences in 2019 getting dumber? I I would feel that I wouldn't say I wouldn't say dumber or smarter. I would say their their minds are getting lazier. You know, they're they're they're, they're getting. They're, what does that mean? They're, 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 does they're that getting, mean dumber? No, no, no. Because a lazy look, mind. Look, 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 look. A lazy, a lazy, a lazy mind, a lazy mind, and and, and 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 a dumb mind. A lazy mind can have a potential to be smart. A dumb mind, you're doing dumb things. You, 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 it's a dumb person. Like like you're wrecking like, mind right look, now. Look, 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 a person, a person, a person that has the potential <laughs> to be great, I'm but sure don't. It's a good mind. You know. <laughs> I see what's going on there. It's, it's a good, good mind. I'm sure it's a good mind. I'm a, sure it's a, a good a, mind. A, per, a, pers- a person that <laughs> has, good, has lazy good. mind. Stay in front of your television. What do you say? 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Turn on your television and turn your brain off. Or I kill it. <laughs> I didn't want to see Iron Man 3 again. All right, go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. I was just lazy thinking. Mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. A, lazy, a lazy mind ha- has the potential to. To be, you know, not dumb. You know what I mean? Like it's like, like, like if you have a dumb mind, if you're just stupid, you're just dumb. Yeah, yeah. No matter then you're dumb. You, no matter, you know, you no, you could just uh, keep being, uh, uh, try your best to, and you're still dumb. Right. You know, people go in here and 
they don't use their brains for stuff. There's like the the spectacles. There's like the but a lazy mind to lonely codes. What, what, what lonely codes saying? A lazy mind is a dumb mind. Because when you're lazy, you're dumb. That's if a brain is lazy, that means mm-hmm. it's not doing anything. Exactly. It chooses to be dumb. Exactly. And that's probably worse mm-hmm. than just being innately dumb. Yeah. Somebody who can that doesn't is worse than somebody who can't. Exactly. I, I just In feel that opinion. you're trying to be nice. In my opinion. Mm-hmm. I feel that you're trying to be nice. Yeah, you're being nice. You're being you're uh, being PC. Flash is barely being PC up in this motherfucker. I mean, AC three of all people, bro. Watch I'm not all. I'm not being PC. I, I just feel like like okay, okay, when it comes to me. When when what's I go worse see, to you? Let me ask you what's worse to you. Yeah. Is what's worse to you is a is it a genius level person who could be an astrophysicist who decides to gangbang and sell drugs and go to prison all the time, or a person who was born retarded that tries to achieve but just can't. Which one's worse to you? Can I answer that question? <laughs> he yeah. knows the answer. Okay. Mm. A retarded person, man. Exactly. So a lazy mind is worse than a dumb one, in my opinion. Because that means you can, but you, you choose not to because you're like, that's to. dumb. But but we're not saying what was worse or better. We're saying, you know, are, are they getting dumber? They're not... The, they're not getting dumber. I don't think a lazy mind is a dumb mind. That's what I was. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't think. You you don't think so? I don't think. I don't think so. I don't think so. Making box office bank. Some do, but some don't. Oh, I read it wrong. I'm sorry. Venom, Venom to to me, I like Venom, but but for the masses, it wasn't it wasn't a good film, you know. But it still made eight, almost nine hundred million, close to a billion, almost Venom. Eight hundred and like sixty right. million dollars. Yeah, you know what I mean. So, so let's do this then. So, but 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 Dark Phoenix, out, uh, Dark and Moon, or whatever. I'll choose either one of them. But nobody saw Edge of Tomorrow. Hmm. Yeah. What happened? An action movie. A real good action. Two movie. Lead, two great lead see stars. That? See that? That's a good a point. A good director. Sci-fi action grounded. Good yeah. story. Good yeah, special yeah. effects. Yeah. Good characters. Yeah. Everything. Flopped. Better cast. That to the point they had to change the title when it came out on Blu-ray. I think they changed the title before it hit theaters, yeah, though. Yeah, Live, Die, Repeat, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Dread, another one. They didn't know how to market it. You talking about People, Judge Dread, the new one? The new one. People went in theaters, enjoyed yeah. it. You know what I'm saying? But bad marketing, like the trailers and the, the bad advertising hurt it. Yeah. Good movie when people came out, but, you know. Hey, hey, to, to, to be honest, bro, I agree with you. Look, look, the to, name is helping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, to, nobody's to, going for the stars. To, yeah, to, the name to, is different. Okay, 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 okay. So okay yes, well, but can you, people are not thinking. Can, can, you call, can you call a person dumb for for, for choosing to go out of two movies? A movie that has great great promotion and, and, and another one that Transformers. has. Transformers. Yeah, exactly. So, can you blame the person for What's one the other one? Want to go there and uh, it's tomorrow. I got him. Hold on. You know what I mean? Like if they if they have uh freaking trailers coming out every day, uh, every second, and and it's known to me as a movie goer, I'm gonna go there before going to Edge of Tomorrow. You got him? Yeah. I got All right. Him. So we're in the age of social media and technology. You can easily research and look something up instead of going off of word of mouth. There's ways to find sources. You can look at reviews. You can watch a lot of people, us. A lot of people it, don't do you that. You can it, go online. You can look at advertising. If I don't know what's there, it, though, it, I'm not going to look at it just tomorrow. It, it, if I don't see advertise. Who goes yeah. to the movies and like, uh-huh, I'm going to just pick whatever like, and then waste money. Uh, like you're, you're giving it away. You know what I mean? To some degree, you kind of want to know what you're watching. But And if that's not the case, then they really are dumb audiences. Because now you're just buying a ticket just to, to buy it. Does that even make sense? I can't believe I just said that, but I'm saying it. Does some, that make sense? Some people go to the movie theater without knowing what's out, Ronin, and they just uh, pick from the and screen. They just, you see what I'm saying? Some people do that. So is I, that I, a thinker? I, think, I need to think you know that was heard of. <laughs> I, I, I think people did that before. I used to work in a movie theater, yeah. and we used to always put out our folder that, of, of what's out, a picture of the title, and a synopsis of it in, on, on the other page. Mm. You'd be surprised how many people come to the theater. Can I see that book? Let me see what's out. Oh, this is about this and that. Mm. We're going to go see that. Two tickets to that, please. You'll be surprised. It's different, man. Like I think we're just kind of in an age where people don't care anymore. Like he said, they go off a of hype and things like that versus doing the research and seeing what's out there, knowing what's popular. That's all. That's what it's about now. It's not about good yeah. content or consistency. What's yeah. popular? What is everybody watching? And, and, and that's um, the worst way to be. Everybody's because there's guilty so of much it. variety and so much options and things. Mm-hmm. And that's why the good stuff gets pushed to the side because nobody's checking for it. Right. They're going off for what's hype and what's popular, good or bad. So you got to take and give. Doggy54 don't like trailers. He doesn't. He likes, and the, if you want quality, he likes the idea of being surprised. If you want quality, we have to put our money I where the quality that. is. So it is tricky. They're looking at, oh, but then, what, but, but, what but, but, Ronan, in, in fairness, it's hard to discern. It's hard to know that Edge of Tomorrow was a quality film, right? 
Yes. Just by looking at the trailers. Yes. But it the takes thing a- is, it's like you can go see stuff now. And like even me, like I, I haven't really gone. I have to literally pick and choose what I want to see now because there's so much fluff out there. I have to wait. The movies that I want to see I, are months in advance. I have to wait. All my stuff comes out October, August, November. That Joker movie, bro. Woo, Joker. Doctor mm. Sleep. Uh, it. I, I have to wait. That's a horror movie. I just yeah. saw Brightburn. Mm-hmm. I love Brightburn. Horror. That's Nobody what I saw it. Horror. Okay, so this. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> just, we're talking about good movies now. It's horror, but good movies though. Brightburn you know, with all that. I mean, no, no, no. But I love Brightburn. Yeah, yeah, it's, me too. But it, it wasn't, wasn't all that. Brightburn was. Good. But why was it not all? That? It was good, but but it wasn't. You made it seem like it was a great. Uh, 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 no, no, no. I just said it was awesome something film. I wanted to see, and okay. it was a sleeper hit. But I I can make anything seem like something's greater than what it is. But I'm just talking about quality versus something that nobody's checking for. <laughs> I, I look for things like that's new and different and creative. Like I have to actually go and do research. Like, all right, this looks interesting. I want to see this. I may not get this over here, and I may not get this here. That's the difference. People ain't doing all that. I know that, People and, and it that. shows in the box office. But, but, but yeah. they don't, don't mean they're dumb, though. Just, just go, just go. You, you, you go the extra uh, 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 extend. I'm not the only one that Looking does up. this. I'm just, I'm speaking from personal. I'm not the only one that does. This. I'm, there's people out there that do it. Like who? There's, or you just assuming this? This no. People it, do what you do. There's, because there's it, 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 it seems like you go. You, you say you you look in advance. You go. Look at movies and stuff like that in advance. I Only people see. are doing that, man. I, I think see what else is um, new. This is why. This is how I would have they, attacked. They, they see. They see a trailer and then they decide of that trailer whether they you it, said they that, that they or not. That, 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 you said that that's kind of looking. That's kind of looking it up. That's I never kinda, said that. That's kind of looking it up though. If you look uh, this at is trailer. how I you said they pick and choose and they find whatever's interesting and they just okay. So they do do a little bit of. Like, no, no, my, 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 my original question was 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 if, if a, a a movie like Transformers got got the best marketing yeah. versus it is tomorrow okay. don't have that much right right the the average person is going to go to to that uh, so the advertisement yeah right. yeah Transformers but a person like you you will go okay okay let me just see what this Edge of Tomorrow is about first let me look it up a person. The average person not go okay. Let me see what this is about. Okay, so, so okay, I'm gonna see that. Why? Oh, they have access to it, so that then that does make them dumber than right. It it it's make it's, oh, it's make you going going okay. uh, above above and beyond. They, they, so they choose not to do it. They choose yeah. Okay, but they could they though, right. They could got them. Mm-hmm. Okay, well we're there. Gator Squad gave us five dollars. <laughs> we're, we're there. <laughs> Shout out to Gator Squad. He said, "What's up, League?" Yo, uh, up, man. I ain't got to catch you guys live in a minute. Guess what? AD here to stay. Ring on its way. <laughs> God dang straight, bro. That's a topic t- today. Uh, Champions. Stay tuned. That's a, that's a topic. Tim Fabro gave us five. Five dollar donation. Thank you, Tim. I appreciate you and the donation, my brother. Tim Fabro says, I believe agendas and person biases have clouded the judgment of the masses. Mm. Basically, this generation is sauce. <laughs> for, for the most part is what he's saying Thanks. And I agree bro I agree Biases in Stop DC, saying. Marvel, Star Wars Z-Shot Media gave us $20 Z-Shot Media Z-Shot Thank you very much Z-Shot Media Z-Shot Media says I had an argument About which 80s or 90s properties Should be revived for live action Like Voltron and G.I. Joe Thundercats Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles oh. He-Man Gargoyles and Power Rangers. Pick one and your director for the franchise. Oh, my God. So he's giving us a challenge. He's challenging the panel. Challenge. So out of these movies, he says, 80s or 90s properties revived for live action. Well, we already right. saw Power Rangers. So okay. Power Rangers I'm ready. Me. I'm ready right now. Terminator 1, director, Mel Gibson. There's mine. Terminator 1, director, Mel Gibson. Man, um, me, I don't know. Directors start like over, that. completely start over with a mm-hmm. new person doing it. Really start over. No, 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 don't really start over from 80s, 90s. Hard yeah, reboot. that's gonna be a fresh new start. Yeah, all the way brand, all the way brand new. Mm. Ready? Yeah, from 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 okay, the the first the first couple movies were 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 good, but then they started getting trash. Aliens, nice alien. James Wan, homie. Oh, okay, yeah. That's Aliens nice. with James yeah, I like that. Wan, homie. Uh, alien goes to the seventies, though. 
Alien, I think, started in the 70s. Come Don't on, change man. and stick with that. Sh- stick with it. <laughs> come on. Hey, you come can on. use it. Come on, man. Yeah. Throw stick me a bone. Throw me a bone. It, bro. All, right. All right, there you go. He said 80s and 90s, though. Aliens who? Rap day. Say it. He said, he said 80s and 90s. Rap it. Aliens, aliens, man. I think Alien is like aliens, cool. Aliens, man. No, say that name. James Wan. He agrees with you. James right. Wan. Facts. I like that. Here we go. There you go. Sure. He agrees with you, man. Hey, come on, that James right. Wan, baby. That James <laughs> Wan, like homie. That. He's uh, fire, my dude. He's, and he's consistent. Yes. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Tight. Greg Martinez put 1977. I was going to say 76, but yeah, I think it's in the 70s. Alien. James Wan. James Wan. He's a great director. See, my thing is, my, my thing is uh, I don't know directors like that. So if uh, if somebody can't help me. Because I did want it to see from the start. So this um, is what we're going to do. This is what we're going to do. You're going to say the movie. Okay. And then we'll help you out with directors. All right. Uh, I did want to see from the start. Um, this was when um, Brad Pitt was younger. and Because I was always a big fan when I was young when I was watching this cartoon. Uh, and he mentioned it in there. Thundercats. Mm. <laughs> I don't know what director might go take that on. <laughs> yeah. All right. So is it live action? Like are they in? Yeah, it's suits? live action. Cause are when it, CG or are they in suits? I'm not sure if y'all remember. It was a rumor saying that Brad Pitt was gonna be uh, um, Lionel. Oh, you're talking about that fan made trailer they did. Yeah. yeah. Are we talking uh, about legit. CG or in costume? Practical effect. They have to be both. Uh, CG. Yeah, well, it would have to be both because um, right. Mamra. Because what? The their their enemy. Their oh, okay. Villain. What's it called? Catnip. Thundercats? Yeah, what do you say? The, the villain. James Mumra. James Mumra. Gunn. Mumra. <laughs> James Gunn. James Gunn, you be picking my person, oh, man. Dude. Okay. Person. You know what? It's my guy. We'll add comedy because we got uh, a James, it. James Gunn. It's my guy. James Gunn. We both had James that Gunn player. then. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I just James so Gunn, it. who you got? Me and HG3 got James Gunn. Who you got? For our Thundercats? Yeah. Oh. Don't forget about Panther because he's black and I thought Wesley Snipes going to be him. Going off of like 80s cartoon. Who's directing that for Little you? Little gritty, probably uh, Paul Verhoeven. I think that'd be dope. Paul Verhoeven, what does he do? Robocop, Starship Troopers. Okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. What about fancy, uh, yeah. uh, what about, sci-fi kind uh, of gritty though? A little like, bit of martial arts. Who, a director does martial arts, but then hey, don't, also, don't, 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 no. We helping you with the director. Don't try to nitpick what we're saying. <laughs> Just take what we're saying. You're not director knowing whore. <laughs> So there it is. All right. James Gunn. Take a Zach Gunn. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So Flash got James Gunn. Hey, 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 if it was all uh, uh, CGI based on like that, J- James Cameron, man, lonely. I'm a, yeah, Freak James Cameron. Nah, Freak, Freak James Cameron. James I want Cameron. Titanic in my movie. James Cameron needs to shut his, his mouth. His Stop movies. being a bitter old man, a hater. Freak James Cameron, bro. Should put more of your life and soul into Alita versus these trash Avatar movies you're going to have come out, bro. Oh anyway, Ronan? Yo. What Zach, you got? Zach Franchise Snyder. and director, bro. Uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, John Woo. Yeah. John Woo, <laughs> Teenage <laughs> Yeah. Like... <laughs> They saw like the 2014 turtles, or like in the costume in suits, like the, the one and 80s two, turtles, the three, the comic book turtles. So in the, the in you want suits. The, where they actually killed the costumes? They were assassins. <laughs> they right. actually, Shredder died, like issue number one. <laughs> that, bro, that. <laughs> Shall Man, fat how, as Master how could Splinter a movie be so? I don't see, I don't see that working. But I see it working. But for that's fans. what it was. It was based off of Batman and Daredevil. They were more yeah, violent. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah. They're ninjas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They mm-hmm. can't be ninjas and not kill. So yeah, okay. going back to basics, we're talking about going back but to basics. Old it's school. Kitty though. No, it's not. You know what I mean? No, it's Kitty now because they first came out. Right. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean the, no, it wasn't. Dark, dark. There, was to- there was toys and yeah, 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 and, and, and friendly games and and, and yeah, yeah. you know, it wasn't that's, never that's great dark like that, yes, bro. They were. It's gonna be like they were. The people gonna be on cell phones. Yeah. They're gonna be on Twitter and shit. Was there blood yeah. back in it? Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, no, bro. No. No. It was no blood, huh? Hold on. Y'all talking about the in, cartoons? In, in Ninja Turtles? Or yeah, the movie. About, yeah. Nah, bro. What? Y- y'all blood? Talking about, blood. Y'all talking about that, but he's talking about the comic. Thank, thank you. Kermit the Log right. says, you guys Ooh, crack dude, me up. It's about movies, yeah, though. Kermit yeah. the Log, bro. I'm talking about the material. That's oh, okay. Kermit the Frog. Right. Oh, no, yeah. they know about me, man. The turtle, the turtle <laughs> fans know what's up. They know what's up. <laughs> That's a family they guy, were bro. Wait, wait, where uh, uh, J3 at? I said that. They know what's up. You already know he's from the time. Oh, yeah, man. The turtles, man, the best thing since cheesecake. It'll pop up then. It'll pop up. Tim $10. Tim Fabro gave us a $10 donation to say this. I'll tell you this. I love looking for movies that fall in the genre that I like. And I'll search when I'm coming out, when it's coming out. For perfect example, Triple Threat and The Raid. Facts. Guys, I check for their movies now. Thank right, you. Because there, there are a dime a dozen. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's what it, you have to check for. Them. That's what I do with animes. Whenever I see a good anime, I, I check for it. Uh, 
the producers that 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 help bring the the help does the animation on the animes. Because you're heavy into anime, that's your thing, right? Yeah, because I I follow Bones. Whatever Bones do, I follow. I go watch it. Sword of the Stranger. Speaking of it, if you haven't seen that movie, it's a really good movie. Um, and the animation's done right in that movie. Okay. Well, yeah, there it is. Bones. Uh, that's how we are with directors and writers, though, in Hollywood. If you apply that to movies, bro, you'll be you be you'll be really knowledgeable. <laughs> I can help you. That's with what that. I'm working on. I'm working, I'm working on it every day. I can help you with that. Yeah. Gotcha, bro. Uh, Bo, Bo Robinson says John Woo would not be the best director for Ninja Turtles. Gareth Evans, and he'll make a better movie. One hundred. I agree with that too. But we're talking about like old school. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Gareth, no, I. I like Gareth Evans. And Trust and believe. Right? On this panel, I love Gareth Evans. Shabuizi mm-hmm. went from uh, hyping up his trash boss of Celtics to saying dumber. Yes. After Infinity War, <laughs> I stopped talking to people at my school about film, especially my gen. People don't understand what a good film is. A dude told me Transformers <laughs> films were great. Uh. Yes, I agree with Shabuizi. I think they're getting dumber. Mm-hmm. They think those Transformers movies are good, bro. When I released my Transformers rant for the last night, you're an idiot, bro. You trash. This movie's just garbage, bro. I ain't never checking for your whack movie reviews ever again. A lot of people in the comment section hating on me for hating Transformers, bro. People like and defend bad movies. You know when I saw Mother, I think I might have been the only person in the theater that knew what it was about while I was watching it. You know how many people were doing it uh, outside the theater? No, that was no, it was about the apocalypse. It's about the asteroids that are just hearing what they thought it was about blew my mind, bro. I had to educate them. People are dumb, bro. Mm. People mm. are smart, but people are movie dumb. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Nah, that's just dumb. They don't care. If anymore. you can't get yeah, that's just dumb. Not Tim Fabro, shout out to him, bro. Five dollars. He says, yo, Ronan, have you seen the tur- the Turtles Forever animated movie? Perfect. You win. Thank you, man. Uh, good question. I have seen it. Uh, it's a really good one. I really enjoyed it. Cool. They merged all the universes together, the different timelines. Did they? Is so that what the they tur- did? Yeah, the Turtles he was talking about. Yeah, so they had those from the 2003, the 80s one, and then the ones from the current cartoon, and they had to come together to uh, close Dimension X. So it was pretty tight. Dope. Turtles Forever. So it was Dope. like a whole homage universe thing going on. It was crazy. All right, man. It's just time to do this. Hit this topic real quick, man. You know what I'm saying? Blah, all that boy. That boy, Bronny. Since Shabuizi's here, you know we got to do it. Blah, all that boy, LeBron. <laughs> hey, check it out. Anthony Davis been traded to the Lakers, bro. <laughs> Anthony Davis been traded to the Lakers, bro. Lakers got AD, bro. Sorry about that. There we go. Anthony Davis traded to the Los Angeles Lakers. We now have a squad, ladies and gentlemen. This will be brief because basketball fans, none of them are. Flash watches a little bit, I guess. Yeah. But this is more of an L.A. thing. So Anthony Davis, who is a top five player in the NBA, he's a certified top five player in the NBA, has been traded to the Los Angeles Lakers to play alongside LeBron James and Kyle Kuzma. So what we did is we traded Brandon Ingram, we traded Good. Lonzo Ball, Good. Josh Hart, the number four overall pick, and two other first round picks. That's a lot. It but is. For AD? For Anthony Davis. I'll even suck, yo. <laughs> <laughs> for AD. <laughs> you feel me? AD's on his way to play with LeBron. We all predicted it would happen. It happened. So now the Los Angeles Lakers, this team in LA, I can say without a shadow of a doubt, will be the best team in the NBA next season. On paper, we're already the best as far as talent. So there's no KD and no no uh, Clay Thompson next year. Right, right. For the most of the year. Um. So we got a uh, Bron, LeBron James. LeBron J- on contract right now. We still have to fill out our slot. Mm-hmm. We have about twenty four million dollars in cap space to add players. I thought it was about thirty. It was thirty if we make our trade by June thirtieth, by July thirtieth. But we're making it on the sixth, so that changes the amount of money that we actually have. Plus, Anthony Davis had a $4 million uh, trade bonus off. that he could have waived, but it looks like he's taking it. So that takes our cap to about $24 million. So we have about $24 million to fill in our, our, our roster with having Kuzma, LeBron, and Anthony Davis on the same squad. See, that's what I like. I love Kuzma. Kuz- and we kept him. 
Kuzma is a good, good player. I love the way he plays. <laughs> he thinks on the court. He looks on the court, and he he can maneuver. He can get that ball around that court. I love the way uh, Kuzma <laughs> plays. What are you laughing at? Oh, you, good. you good, Flash? I'm good. Oh, for sure. Keep going, continue. Continue? Don't mind me. Okay. But, yeah, um, after that trade for AD, um, and leaving Kuzma in there, that was a wonderful thing to yes. do. Yes, yes. Ball, I didn't – Ball, he don't know what uh, – he got to get his father out his out his life. Here are the odds for next year. 2020 title odds, the Lakers are in number one with three to one odds. Hmm. Milwaukee with the second best with uh, six to one. Clippers seven to one. Raptors and Rockets eight and one. Um, I'm, I'm glad my Clippers is up there. We have the best odds to win the championship next season according to uh, Vegas Caesars. So, uh, yeah. Don't, I don't mean nothing though, bro. Usually yeah, those odds are pretty much on point. But, yeah. Uh, David H., five dollars. He said LeBron is the greatest of general managers of all time, and they're going after Kemba Walker and Jimmy Butler too. The thing about that, David H, is you know Kemba Walker gonna have to take less money because he's looking at thirty one, thirty two million dollars max. But overall, how do you feel, guys, about a top five player in the NBA coming to Los Angeles and the Lakers being the best team in the NBA, arguably the best team in the NBA? No. Best team in the NBA next season. Man, how no. I feel? You want to know how I feel? How you feel, bro? Because I'm, not, fan, I'm frigger, not a Lakers fan at all. Lakers hating here. some bitch. And it's a long story why I don't like the Lakers. but uh, <laughs> Yeah, we back now, bro. <laughs> but when they do smart things like this, I it's, it, you can't. It's like you can't have hate, to. Can't you hate. Have, yeah. got to take that hat off you, and nod it. Yeah, I, you got to take that fanboy stuff yeah. off and be like, here, man, you did it. That's you guys are great. I might have to be watching on games now. Yeah. What? Oh, you're weak, Flash. I know. Because yeah. it's entertaining basketball, baby. It's going to be lobs and shit. I was mad. I was mad Locks at the Clippers the when place. they traded Harris. But, yeah, go ahead. Oh. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I feel the – I know. I know. <laughs> and, and, and how old is AD? 26. Mm-hmm. Okay. So he, he took some legs left. Yeah, some legs left. Yes. Uh, bro, I feel I feel that as far as far as the trade goes, I feel that the Pelicans, I think, for just one player, no matter how great he is, the Lakers gave up too much. You think so? They gave up a lot. They gave up three players. I know their players was it's whatever players, but they gave up what four draft picks? Three, three draft picks and three players. Yeah, yeah. So these draft picks were worth for first. One first of the draft picks was uh, for the number four overall number four. for this year. Yeah, and the other ones will be high uh, picks. I'm saying, I'm saying, look, look, this one when we talk about the same thing when they got the um, they got oh, I don't know if it, it, when they when they got Kobe when it was Kobe Nash and somebody else. Yeah, yeah, Chris Paul trade that was vetoed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. but they got they had Dwight Howard. Kobe and he had Nash, right? All, we, all we, had, we had Dwight, Kobe, Nash, and Pau Gasol. And Pau Gasol. And what, how far did y'all go? We got we got <laughs> no, to no. the playoffs and we were eliminated in the first round uh, by San Antonio, I believe. That's what I'm saying. Like, like um, our coach so, was trash. Yeah, that was the problem. We yeah, had okay. a trash yeah, that, uh, coach, Mike D'Antoni. Yeah, Mike D'Antoni. Yeah. Okay. They bench, he benched Pau Gasol. Oh my. <laughs> the the these look I. I know it's a it's it's a win now league, you know, but but I feel that they gave they gave too too much for uh, for AD man like the, he, he's not to me he's not worth that much. You say you say he's top five he's top yeah he's top five but he's uh, not just think, top five he's generational though. Think of it think of it this way, we ain't talking about a player getting moved like this since Shaq bro. Someone from Orlando right? He has Shaq type numbers and Shaq type, not as much impact as Shaq but it's there. And, uh, when Shaq first came, they even did their numbers on ESPN. They averaged the same amount of stats: twenty-seven, eleven, and, and two blocks and two steals. It's crazy, bro. Only if he was breaking. This court. is not just a good player. This is a good generational. This, you ain't gonna get this for like twenty, thirty years. Yeah, I, I know. Uh, it's big shoulders. Uh, I feel. I feel that uh, with with LeBron going down, he he's going down. He, he he's stepping down. I don't feel like we we gonna get the same LeBron. I. I feel that it's gonna be too much pressure on AD shoulders. I know he got he got big shoulders, you know. Uh 
I love Big Shoulders. I feel like he Sucks. he he's not gonna handle the pressure right, man. This Hollywood man, this this, this is whole different whole different area than freaking New Orleans, man. You know, like like I feel. So you, they got a they got a mesh together, you know. Do you, I, I get I get he's a good player, but but it's it, it's more than just putting putting good players together, man. Just hoping for the best, you know. Yeah. It it, it will they get to the get to the playoffs? Yeah, they will. But it's it, it's more than just those two. You gotta yeah. you gotta you gotta get a good we okay a, bench. We, yeah, you know, yeah. it, it, it's more than just eight. Yeah, it's eight, not, it's eight not eight can't run this team. It's not over. It's LeBron is there too. He's not chopped liver, bro. LeBron's not what he was though. LeBron like, like, will average twenty five plus next season, bro. That's all we need him. To he'll do. average twenty. He'll average almost a triple double again, bro. With with, with him always deferring to the next person. The thing like, is, like, he can play differently now. He can play chiller now, which makes him more deadly. He don't have to do as much, especially defensively. Anthony Davis is a defensive machine. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. of course. Yeah, he's a rebounding machine. Yeah. that's mm-hmm. less that LeBron has to do. Mm-hmm. LeBron is can play point. He can play point, I, dish out, score, dunk, whatever, shoot three. Eddie Davis is a stretch center that can shoot threes, bro. I still believe that the OKC is going to. OKC? Yeah. Heck no. They freaking white, man. They weak. Mm-hmm. But, they they still, still, but they do got Aquaman okay, still, don't they? They have all that talent. They got put out, bro. Westbrook, uh, you uh, can't uh, win with Westbrook, bro. OKC tight, bro. You can't you win can't. with That's Westbrook. That's my team. Can you win with Westbrook? No. It. it, it if he changes up his game plan, yeah, you can. His attitude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Attitude. That's attitude. attitude. That's attitude. That's who he yeah. is, bro. Yeah, it's attitude, you know, bro. He ain't, uh, can't win with, with Westbrook, that's bro. Why, that's Westbrook why KD is left. That's why KD left. Yeah, Westbrook is a yeah. rely on his body player. Like you ain't got no fundamentals like that. You can't shoot. Your he finesse game shoot. is weak. Yeah, yeah, You're one shoot. injury away from being wiped. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You don't. You don't have that type of stuff. Legend of Old One on One. Five dollars. Shout to you, my dude. Legend. He said. I used to watch basketball, <laughs> but I enjoy hearing you guys talk about it. Keep up the great work. Thanks, Legend of Old. Thanks, Solomon, man. I appreciate you, dude. Yeah, OKC's overrated. Uh, Jay Sean 3000 x says AKC, OKC's overrated. Westbrook ain't helping nobody. He said WG, WG Champions, my man from New York. Uh, Devin Fitz says Anthony Davis is defensive anchor. LeBron never had. Exactly, Devin. That's what I'm talking about. So you have an offensive juggernaut and now a defensive juggernaut. And as your anchors, and that's Kuzma. crazy. And Kuzma, and Kuzma mm-hmm. which at, he'll probably average twenty this season. And then we have twenty four million, some odd million dollars. JJ Redick is out there; he's a great shooter. <clears throat> oh, Danny uh, Green is out there. JJ Redick, he's um, free he's available. He's available. It, it, oh, is there wow. it, is there any chance of of you guys getting uh, Kawhi Leonard? No, no chance. I think that chance is kind of gone now because we only got we don't have the cap space. We did have the cap space. He, he, might, he might thirty. He might come and play. Just give me for ten, man. I just want to be here. If quite come for twenty four, <laughs> yeah, we got him. <laughs> you see me? You see me? Like the person that don't really care about money like I, that. I really wanted to add Kawhi to that, and it's just now, now, di- now, that's now, dynasty, bro, bro. If you had, if you had Kawhi, man, dynasty, they're winning for the next five years. Man. Exactly, they're <laughs> dynasty. If y'all get, if y'all get um, Kawhi, man, I'll, yellow, straight, <laughs> straight bandwagon <laughs> fan right here, bro. You a you a bandwagon <laughs> fan. I can't Dude, wait to talk about mother freaker, bro. Hey, 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 I can't wait to talk about freaking uh, 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 the NFL with your your butt, man. I cannot wait, bro. This is gonna be fun. Nine is all day, bro. He gonna change that quick watch. <laughs> Patriots, Patriots. I think nah, Trinity. Man. I think I think we still could have Rondo. I think we can still keep Rondo. If Rondo. We want to. If y'all yeah. can't get Reddick, because Reddick is good. He's good free throw shot. He's good, good shot point mid shot, yeah. midpoint yeah, shot yeah, too. Yeah. Reddick will be a good. Uh, Derrick Rose is out there too. Huh. No, he had a, okay. no, and coming off a good year though. No, no, he had a no. great year in Minnesota his, last his year. His knees. You, you better not year. get him. You better not pull him up, man. I'll pick him up. <clears throat> Yo, pull him I'll up. pick him up. Not over <clears throat> other players, but if it comes down to it, I'll pick him up. Rather, I mean, like for like five million, maybe. I'll give him five, ten. Yeah. Off I'll that bench, ten. off that bench, heavy. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> He'll All be right. starting. Uh, yeah. If we waited till July 30th, we would have been good, man. But the Pelicans won't wait. I don't think. Yeah, I they didn't want to wait. They 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 yeah. they saw what y'all got because they need it. Yeah, I'll be. I'm so David A now. says Lakers been trying to build through the draft for six years. The trade was good to me. A certified superstar for potential picks that might be busts. You make that deal if it's a superstar, bro. <clears throat> you got to make that deal, Ronald. What do you think about a generational player? 
coming to the Lakers and making us relevant again, bro. City of LA. Oh, we definitely You're here for LeBron. Uh, I think it's going to make the games exciting again because they've been kind of stale. Yeah. Kind of I think it's going to yeah. be an event. Again. I think that's what basketball is missing. Because they got two now. What uh, Lakers, man, <laughs> the old school prime will still be like the greatest uh, all star team, like old school Lakers that we had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like this, this could be the beginning of that. That era, yeah. Again, and I think it's going to be an event again because before you're just watching to be watching. Oh, there's nothing else on. Let me watch the game. Yeah. And I never really paid attention to like the rare game. I always <clears throat> watch like the All Star stuff because that's kind of where it counts. Yeah. But if this, if we're going to get this, I, I'll get back into it again because it's been a while since I've watched. It's time for LA to stand back up, baby. Yeah. And that's exactly what AD brings. So we need it, new man. life to the Lakers, baby. Woo! Lakers on top, bro. I, I caught the last few games and they were they were exciting. Yeah. They were exciting, so. Got LeBron. I told you I was going to happen. There's a spark. Shabuzi, you suck, man. I'm yeah. weekend is Boston Celtics, bro. You gotta go easy on too easy, man. But Boston sucks. I was gonna ask that, Bobo. <laughs> Could we still get a max line and just go over the cap? The ESPN fools making it seem like we just can't go over the cap. You know what I'm saying? But you can't go over the cap. No, you can. Cap. You pay luxury tax. But I don't oh, know. If, okay. I, don't, I don't know if this trading situation with getting Anthony. I don't know if there was a rule in place <clears throat> where you get a player from another team and you give away assets like that. You can't sign another max and then go over the cap. They be having some stupid stipulations yeah, yeah, yeah. like that. I don't really be knowing that. But if Bubble, if that's the truth, man, if that's what's going on, Kawhi Leonard coming to LA, my dude. I mean, look, look, give Kawhi that max, bro. How much you want? 180, 200 million here. Two hundred. Oh my, two hundred million. That's <laughs> what they go for, bro. Max is like two. The, the, the but how many lock, years? The cap went up. Uh, five. How many? Years? Like ten. Five, <laughs> five and two hundred. Yeah, something like that. Supermax is like five and two twenty. Oh my, it oh would my be god. Nice if we got him though. That would be nice if we get him on. That means our taxes yeah, look, gonna be up there. Look, 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 how you you, you 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 got you got a player in, in LeBron James, uh, arguably the the best player on on the planet, arguably. You know, arguably. And you guys got you guys didn't make the playoffs, right? Uh, we had injuries. Injuries. Yeah, we had injuries. So just getting AD. And we bro. had locker room issues. We had a lot of turmoil and drama in the locker room. We mm-hmm. had to get rid of these young guys. These young guys had to go. Definitely, they don't, that, they don't that care about the Brandon because yeah, wasn't he yeah. the one recording Fighting the team? And all that. And no, no, that was someone. Else. That was a uh, D'Angelo Russell. We got rid of him last so, year. So, so do you predict them going to the to the finals this year? Yes. I mean, uh, uh, this yes. Year? I think we're the best team uh, in the West. I'm thinking they going I to the playoffs. We are the best team in the West. There's no team on paper. We have more talent. And go, Corvus go. said something blasphemous. AD and LeBron can't do it themselves, Jody. Didn't, wasn't everybody saying Houston was going to win the chip? Didn't they say Houston could challenge Golden State for all those years? And how many superstars on that team? Two. How many star players? Two. Chris Paul, James Harden. After them two, bums. Not bums, but fill in players. But they're, they're, they're kind Anthony of they- Davis and LeBron are better than Chris Paul and James Harden. But yeah, but they 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 kind of they kind of the same kind of players though. Huh? J- J- James Harden and Chris Paul, they they kind of the same kind of like Yeah, yeah, type kind of type yeah, players, point yeah. guard and shooting guard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sh- shoot threes, get us a- Yeah. Bro, the Lakers got certified stars in great positions, man. You know what I'm saying? We us two with LeBron and Anthony Davis are way better than Chris Paul and James Harden. Facts. Facts. Peace out, Bubba. And that Houston sheet didn't work. We coming straight to the finals. There's, we're the best team in the West, bro. In the NBA, talent-wise. But Golden State's players are injured. That's why I'm not counting them because they're not going to be there next season. It's just going to be It's just gonna be uh, Steph Curry and then Draymond Green and then whatever, Iguodala and shit. So, so Clay, Clay, Clay is out. Torres Achilles. Achilles. I mean his uh, his uh, ACL. Uh, Nate, yeah. Mm-hmm. So and, and it's like a probably like a six months. They're saying nine. Saying nine. I'm hearing months. nine, and the KD could be a year plus, man. A year plus. It could be yeah. Rehabilitation for the Achilles is much harder. Strenuous. I'm still suffering from mine. Yeah, it's a lingering thing. <laughs> The guy, you looked at him. <laughs> Look how you looked at him. All right, fine. Well, we're done with this topic. Lakers is tight. Shabuizi, your Celtics is washed. Just like I told you, uh, Kyrie Irving, he's out of there. And uh, y'all lost your best player, Kyrie Irving. And then Tatum. Tatum, I'm sure Tatum will stick around and continue to give you guys chances of getting into the playoffs year after year until Tatum finally says, trade me to the Lakers. I want to play with Kobe uh, as my daddy, uh, teaching me everything. Oh, man. AD got people that could really train them. So you guys wanted – I want to give a surprise reaction for you guys because we were talking about it on the panel. This is not over with. We'll be right back.
Ladies and gentlemen, we are back and we're giving you a special reaction for Dr. Bleep. Dr. Sleep, homie. Dr. Bleep, bruh. Dr. Bleep. Dr. Bleep. There's going to be some Dr. Bleep shit. So let's go ahead and get into the reaction for Dr. Sleep. I was talking to the panel guys and I, I was asking them, is this demonic or is it like, it's not, no, no, it was like not really, you know what I'm saying? It's like something with the shining. But then the shiny, he wasn't really demonic in there either. He was just like worded, spoken of to be like yeah. creepy or something. I don't know. The movie relied on Jack's performance. Okay, yeah, so kinda. we're going to check out Dr. Bleep. I mean, <laughs> Dr. Sleep. <laughs> Dr. Bleep. <laughs> <laughs> so let's go ahead and check out the reaction to Dr. Sleep and see what's going on. Psycho. You heard voices. Obi-Wan, baby. Is he the same guy? Don't age. He's the son. The son? Uh, Danny oh. Torrance. They seen those twins? Red Rom. Mm -hmm. Red Rom. I'm hard as fuck. You and McGregor don't age, yo. He don't age, bruh. He don't age. Oh, poop. Red Rom. Just talk to the kid. Murder backwards. You're magic. Like me. I need you to listen to Look at me. that fire right there, bro. It's fire. It's a hungry place. Yes. That's your fire place. right there. It's hot. That was fire. Hi. That was fire. I only met two or three people like us. They died. When I was a kid, I bumped into these They're things. They're taking her down, bro. They got that. I don't know about magic. I... I always called it The Shining. Johnny! That's good. Dr. 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 Bleep, homie. Dr. Bleep. All right. That was a... Uh... Okay, um... <laughs> Go ahead and show the scary so twins close, get bro. wrecked. It was so close. It was so close. What? The... For the, um... The, the stuff in this movie. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Well, all right, I'm not going to see this in theaters. I haven't seen The Shining, and here's an experience for a guy who's never seen Shining. This didn't interest me at all. I have no idea what's going on. That's right. And it looks yeah. boring as freak. They added a lot of a lot of uh, flashback scenes. In this. Yeah, this looks boring as heck, and that's because I don't know what's going on. Mm -hmm. So in case you guys want to know what a guy who doesn't who's not a fan and his reaction is I, that's mine yeah. I have no desire Dr. Bleep, to see homie. this cause no, I didn't no. I didn't completely watch the signing the the full thing of The Shining when it first came out when oh, it came okay. out well not when it first came out but period the first movie I, I haven't seen it completely but I've I seen need it to like go watch it two times way back when I was like a kid so you don't remember what it's about I, I, I yeah I know I know that that the guy the guy he he hears voices it's kind of like a What's what can you compare? Well, you don't watch horror, so so it's like a, a, a Amityville horror. I was just about to say Amityville, yeah. yeah, like that. Where like yeah. a guy, there's something in 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 the mansion, his home, the, the house, whatever, that's telling him to do evil things, and he's going psycho, oh, and okay. and he tried to kill his family, okay. and and I think I think that Doctor Bleep, 
Dr. Bleep, uh, <laughs> it, it's going to take us in into give us more answers mm, uh, about everybody. about how, how how the entity or something like that whatever got into the mansion. You know, you start saying her titties. Mm. I know. I was reading that what too. I don't want to. Titties. Mm. Oh, they drooling. Oh, uh-huh. she leaking. How is her titties drooling? Oh, no, no. Uh, it, it, no. she says my titties, and then her mouth is. So she's getting aroused, and then her mouth is drooling. Oh, yeah. oh! She you know how we say buckets to come. I'm yeah. leaking her titties. Oh, okay, okay. So I guess she, if, you, if you suck on that a while, to make her some some girls come to the titty lick, and I think she's probably one of them. They do, they yeah. do, they do. Sometimes they, that's it, where their spot is. Uh, uh, I asked, I asked a, a girl, random girl. I'm like, uh, uh, <laughs> what do you, what do you like more, me to lick your nipples or lick your clit? She's like, my nipples. I'm like. I, I just went in for it. Yeah. Well, but yeah, a handful of booty while she riding you in a titty in your mouth. Yeah, I I, I, I had a had a girl ride me, and then she titty she just right did, here. bro, bro. She like this. She like this. She was was she, smaller she her face. It to you? Fire! I'm like, Fire. Oh, 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 get it, get it, Fire. get it, huh? Give me that <laughs> with the other like hand a, on a like, butt cheek, like a newborn baby, man. Mm. But anyway, man, yeah. <laughs> but I feel I feel that uh, 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 Doctor Bleep, this movie going to going to give us the answers to 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 the questions we had in the shiny like 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 what what is that what what are those two girls you know mm-hmm. what why is he going psycho you know when then it seemed it seemed to me like uh, they have some kind of cult was going on and maybe. They probably summon some entity or something like that, and then it takes over their bodies. Because I've seen a few a few characters that had like the uh, uh, haze over eyes, Ronan. Like so, mm-hmm. so maybe they get taken over by by some kind of spiritual being or something like that. Oh, right. entities, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and then he even said um, that that he met two of them. Yeah. So so those two girls mm-hmm. were, were those those little blue dresses that, that was in the hallway. Those those were the same things that that are are, are in this one. Yeah, you know. So, so he th- basically crazy. had he had an experience. Yeah, he yeah. They escaped that nightmare. Yeah, his dad didn't come out of it. Jack didn't come out of right, it. Right, 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 right. They tried they tried to get him too. Yeah, the lot, boy, right. And a lot of that history and a lot of those people that were in that hotel died in the hotel. Remember that painting at the end? Mm-hmm. It showed yeah, everybody that was alive around that time. Jack was on that picture too. Yeah, he froze to death out there. Mm-hmm. But uh, a lot of stuff and a lot of uh, nightmares and stuff had went down in that room two thirty seven where they were standing at the hotel. But this new one, uh, Ewan McGregor, uh, Danny Torrance, he, Doctor Sleep, he's this psychic that's able to Bleep. attack on and yeah. take on these other entities. So he's fighting these forces, and and there's a group of him and other people that are hunting these people down because they're out there uh, trying to get into people's minds. Mm-hmm. So there is like a psychic uh, supernatural warfare going on, but he's out there fighting it. Hmm. Okay, so he's the one like hypnosis. So when you said that, he, yeah, exactly. So it's not it's not like a hallucination anymore. It's it's becoming a reality. Mm-hmm. He's seen it. He's trying to put the word out. Mm. It's going to be interesting. And then you got... um. You got Mike Flanagan doing it, who's been uh, really killing the horror game right now. Like he's doing a lot of Netflix stuff. Uh, mm-hmm. Gerald's Game, mm-hmm. uh, Hush was really dope. Under love that Rated movie. Uh, Oculus, uh, The Hunter love, Hill House. You seen that? Love that Oculus. Yeah. Love that movie. That's an A plus movie three for, for me, bro. All right, you're welcome. And yeah. Hunter <laughs> Hill House. He did that series too for Netflix. Love that movie. So this man's on fire right now. This, this guy is doing hitters, bro. And he's doing a direct sequel to uh, Stanley Kubrick's uh, 1980 film, and it looks like he's capturing the same style. I like yeah. it. This is a fire trailer. I would be happy if they did not release any more. Cause this, I want to go in cold and just experience it. Too much for like too much previews and uh, information for a horror movie can kind of ruin it. Cause we're gonna see okay. the images and the setup. So this is a great teaser. We got the tone. We're in. We know what's going on. This is enough for me. I don't need to see no more. You say and and and, and Jody, you say you say it's boring because you haven't seen the the shiny or it's it just the the trailer itself don't don't look appealing to you. You know. And I feel, I feel like that goes back to, to to us needing to see action and stuff like that for for it to be a good trailer. To you, is that is that why it, it don't it don't seem appealing because it's it seems kind of boring because it, it's not really showing much. Is it is that the reason you think? No, no, because I see a lot of trailers that didn't have any action at all that get me really excited. Like what? Choker. Joker gets me excited. Okay, uh, okay. Besides, besides DC, uh, DC, 
Uh, and, and, and besides war films, because I know you love the war films, like like Christopher what? Nolan movie, any Christopher Nolan movie, even though his trailers suck, all his trailers suck. But, it's, it's but like, those are like Christopher Nolan movies, is like, you, you love Christopher Nolan is known for you love him though, so trailer. it's kind of it's kind of like a biased thing because you you know that he gonna put put out some hot stuff. All right, uh, so so any movie Once like Upon Time in Hollywood, that's a trailer that a lot of people didn't like that I I, I can't wait. Man, dude. That trailer was nothing. You know, it's the clips. actors, bro. It's the, the, it's the actors. The actors pull you in, bro. Come on, bro. All right. The actors pull okay. you in, bro. Right, you, you can't go. say that. If, if, if Ewan McGregor, instead of it being him, was Leonardo DiCaprio, I'd be liking this trailer then, right? I'd be saying, hey, I want to see it. Facts, facts. So you can't add actors, man. If you if, if I see an actor in the trailer I like, then that counts. Okay. okay. It, it's, still a tra- it's still a freaking... Okay. okay That's why it, I said... It, Different things grab people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all, that's uh, 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 the, the Scorsese film coming up, uh, The Irishman. Mm. Trailer's nothing. I'm seeing that, my dude. I'm seeing it. The name. My yeah, God. I mean, there's a lot of, yeah. no, trailers don't have to have action for me to like them. There's right. there's very few of them that, that, so, that, that so, do. So, Ma. Well, well, Ma well, made me want to watch it. When I saw the trailers for Ma, oh, I'm seeing that. Don't make me drink alone. Don't, don't make, make me drink, drink alone. alone. <laughs> <laughs> hey. I am, I'm there for that, bro. <laughs> just the premise of it had me excited. So, what in this trailer just turns you off? It relies on its the original. It relies on other. It, it relies. There's. It doesn't give a general audience member information to get them excited to go watch it. Mm-hmm. You see these two little girls in the hallway. Uh, looking at it, it looks like a man who is uh, uh, has a has a history. And I, and uh, he's trying to figure out stuff, and, and I don't know, just don't know. I can't really call what. It, 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 well, who's the girl he's talking to? We don't. Why are you talking to a random black girl on a bench? That uh, are you that, a pedophile? Hey, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I feel <laughs> I feel that because it showed it showed her getting getting possessed. So maybe maybe he's trying she to. She has the same. She she either been in that whole uh, mansion. Like he did, and Maybe. also got out. Like See, he you're, did. You're talking about something that happened in the film. That that's I'm the looking thing. at it as a trailer for the first time, so I don't tie that so, girl in her white eyes to anything that ever happened anywhere. So, so, so I think that there's clearly a, a dark a spirit, ominous thing going on around. Yeah, right. lingering around here. Yeah. But it doesn't tell you what or where, what or why, or even I can't put two and two together and off that t- teaser they gave me. It's like it's like um, Hereditary, the movie. You what the heck is it? all that blood coming down the hallway? That, 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 that's from that was an illusion. Part illusion. one, yeah, so, yeah, yeah, that's all illusions. You gotta, you gotta watch part know. one, like you said. Theatricality and deception, powerful agents to the uninitiated, but we are initiated, aren't we, Bruce? Don't start this. Don't do it, man. Cause, cause, cause I'm gonna be in tears again, man. Come on, man. Good right. lord. But yeah, but but it's like it's like a, a hereditary. That that's one of my 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 top my my top films ever, man. Like like that 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 film was awesome, but. The trailers, That's right, baby. The, the, the 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 trailers wasn't all that either, you know. But I was drawn to it. It, it was about it, the trailer it, though. It, it was you yeah, about the trailer though. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't. It wasn't. I know, but it wasn't a, a, a sequel like that. But, but you went what, to see Hereditary because it was a horror, bro. Yeah, but it wasn't. Same marketed thing. As same thing. No, 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 but but it wasn't like you said. It, it, it wasn't. It wasn't like that, bro. It something pulled me into that trailer, drama, bro, and then drama. made me go see it because I didn't know. It felt uh, like a horror to you. That's why. But but it, I I didn't know what it was before that. It was it it, it uh, horror. When, when the sequel, it went a prequel. You knew it, it was it a horror. Annabelle comes you knew home. It was, it was a horror. Annabelle goes shopping. You love the horror franchise. That's why you went to go see. I it. want. I like to watch horror. I don't love it. I like it. I like a good horror film. I think you love it. I think you love it. And, and, I think and, you love and, it. Any horror that comes out, you're gonna go watch. I think that's love. I am not going to see Annabelle Comes Home. Because you know that you've seen what? <laughs> because you know you've seen bad ones. Hey, I'm you've not, already seen bad ones. That's why. I, hey, I'm not I'm not going to see Insidious Part 5 or something like that. The uh, uh the, the 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 first key. I'm not I'm not going to see those movies, but, Jody. Because you know that they 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 they're not good. Annabelle's not tight, Cover. Stop. <laughs> they're going to be annoyed right there. If they, if they come out with a, 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 a original horror, you're gonna see it. Cause it's horror. You know nothing about it, but it's horror, you're gonna see it. It's the equivalent of me and Nolan. The the, the it was it was with the 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 what give me is the the horror when you see a trailer and like it, it, it jump scares, you know, it come at you. I like, hate jump scares. 
I mean, no, no, in the trailer to get you get you uh, uh, hooked in. That don't get me hooked in. They make sure Hereditary didn't get then they, they give us that. Bad. Yes. Doc, Doctor Sleep, it 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 give me like a, a psychological like like it's gonna like Hereditary. It, it's gonna it's gonna be a smart film with great acting. It was it wasn't a hard uh, 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 aspect of Hereditary that made me uh, love it. It was the great acting, man. I'm it was about the, what it was made the you emotion. See it. Good. The trailer. Horror. You knew it was horror. I know. I we didn't see nothing horror. It, we didn't see no Let's kind of hereditary monster. trailer right now. I bet you it's gonna look let's like it's it. horror. Let's do it. Bet it's gonna look like let's it's horror. Let's do it. Bet let's it's gonna it. look like it's horror. Ronan. Let's, let's, let's do it. Let's roll it. Hey, 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 hey. Work Tim Favreau. He says, AC3, if you were really a horror fan, you would have seen Jeepers Creepers 3. A- exactly. I haven't seen it, but you have. I have. Okay. <laughs> I'm a Jeepers <laughs> Creepers fan. <laughs> Oh my I haven't God. seen it, but oh yo, yo ass have. I'm a, I'm a Jeepers Creepers fan. That's why. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Well, one and two is where it stops for me. <laughs> what is it called? Hereditary. Hereditary. Yeah. Did you see the trailer for a Midsummer? No, no, I see. Same yeah, director. Same director. Yeah, it, look, it looks. I think they could be in the same universe. It looks like it's a cold or something. A Midsummer dream. But it's in the daytime. Be just like, screaming. Midsummer. midsummer? Yeah. She's screaming on the thumbnail. Okay, she's screaming. All right, all right. Look, we watching it. A dollhouse. Ain't scary at all. Peter. If you gonna talk. <laughs> that lets me know it's a horror. It's heartening to see so many strange new faces here today. I know my mom would be very touched and probably a little suspicious. My mother Bruh. was Bruh. a very secretive Stop. and private. Stop! Woman. Leave her alone. Bruh, 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 bruh. The drawings in the book, bruh. The witch, producer of the witch. Let me feed you because she needed to feed you. She was a very difficult woman. Oh my God, that girl. girl. Stop. I recognize you from your mother. Get the freak out of here, Asian dude. She was clearly a whore. No, it's not. What is wrong with you? I can feel them in the room. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my, bruh. Oh my. AC3. This ain't a horror. Oh, nah, AC3, three, you, 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 you dumb. Three man, then you dumb. If you saw oh, this, look, look at that. Oh, that oh my, oh my, oh, oh, her face. Oh, What's wrong with her face? That, that neck. What happened to her that eyes? Neck. Her oh, eyes. Oh, oh my, oh, oh, oh. It feels, oh. It feels like if I touched the side of her face, for like I rubbed it on the side right. of a house. It's so oh, many different lumps and layers. Oh, it's so much thing. It's so much going on. Oh my! Oh! oh. oh. It says horror right there in the commercial. She's walking upside down. Terrifying! Terrifying! What the freak is that? Oh my! Oh! 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 Run! He's on fire! AC3, shut the freak up, man! That means horror. horror. That means horror gets away on fire. Man, you freaking trick me, bro, Satan. Bruh, bro, this is a freaking horror. Satan, what are you oh talking about? Just because we're on fire, don't mean it's a horror. My God! Go to that part sure. when you saw that little girl For walking sure. towards the camera, oh bro. Go to the, oh my! Look at that! What neck. is that? What is that? What's going what is on? That? Oh That's she, a real face. Leave she, her alone. She looks, uh, why does she look like <laughs> Dustin from Stranger Things? <laughs> Woo! Wow. <laughs> Man, she oh. looked, she, what was that movie when that dude had an elephantitis she, and the, and, and the girl like, was blind? <laughs> she looks like Dustin from Stranger Things. That, oh hey, 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 that's her. That's her real face, man. Like, yeah. like, l- l- lay off the real. It's her real face. Yes, that's, that's her, not makeup. That's her real face, bro. Those big knots that look like no, a booty cheeks. Uh, those are oh, her face. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's oh, her real face. I thought that, that was makeup. No, no man, heck no. Uh, that's her. Uh, oh, I take it back. That neck though. I take it back. I, yeah. that, I thought that was makeup. <laughs> That's that, a real face, man. That neck Story. and the shoulders, bro. <laughs> that neck. <sighs> okay, we can turn this horror thing off. Horror. We can turn this horror thing off. It's more It's, more, it's more of a horror. Grips you with real horror. Uh, an unspeakable kind. It, okay. It's, it, it's, more, it's more of a wait, 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 wait. You seen this trailer and didn't know it was a horror? That's what you're trying to sell me on? I didn't go to hey, the- man. I heard you got magic beans, my G. <laughs> Run around the block. Because <laughs> you got them good magic beans, bro. I heard you got beans he that if you put water on them, back, it turns into a beanstalk. He, he you to and it'll take you to stock, the, and up there gold bars and mm-hmm. shit. Mm-hmm. Hey, man, I'll give you my whole life for three of your beans, bro. 
Can I get your magic beans? If you eat one of these beans, yeah. you'd be full for a whole year. Freak out of here, you talking about, bro. You knew God good and God day. Well, that's a horror. This, this was a, a, a hard, hard drama thriller to me. Because I, I didn't really see anything that was the no, horror base. Did that you? Girl was born to be did movie. you see any, it was, anything horror? It was thriller. It was more thriller. Yeah. It's, it's, but it's, the trailers is showing it as a, it's not. The movie's. What? Is, Let what? me ask you a question. Is it a horror movie? Yes, it is. It's, it's thriller, it is. bro. All right, there it is. It's He's saying it's a thriller. You're saying it's a horror. It's, it's a horror, Ronan. Look. Okay, but you won't watch it, so you'll never know. Uh, no, I will know. You saw the trailer. This is how I will that's know. How, that's that's trickery. This is how I'll know. The AV club grips you with. Real I understand horror. what H three was trying to say, but I can't. I can't say anymore because he'll you can't? never watch oh, it. You he can't? won't see it. Oh, 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 no, 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 don't, don't, don't let me get in your way. Let's look it up on the internet. That's how I'll know. What's it called? Hereditary. 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 Mm. Let's see what pops up under its genre. Mr. Ronan Joe Triple uh, CK, he, uh, he used that as a... It's going to say horror. Drama. Mystery. Horror. Yeah. That's how I know. Mm. Triple. <laughs> I things. didn't see no suspense in that list, well, Ronan. I didn't say suspense. I said thriller. Thriller. Yeah. Let me see a thriller in here. Yeah, it's in there. No. Nah. Drama. There? Drama. Horror. Mystery. mystery. Okay. Triple. Yeah, that's how I'm going to know. Tally can eat follow up. Okay. <laughs> got him, got yeah. him. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Get yeah, yeah, yeah. Got him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. No, he didn't. You didn't get me, homie. You didn't get me. This is a thriller. Next topic. <laughs> you didn't get me, homie. This is a thriller. You can't get me, homie. Uh, <laughs> don't know. Freak, homie. Next topic. Telekinesis, bro. You got insulted. Yeah. <laughs> You <laughs> like freaking Jody? Yeah. <laughs> 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 that face! That face! That face! He can't that face! Look, look, look. He can't hurt that face! What? Look at him! Look at him! He can't hurt oh that God. face! It's so apparent! <laughs> It's so apparent. <laughs> yeah. Like when you, use a, when you lose a Yu-Gi-Oh duel, but you... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know how that feels. I never play Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That face uh, half, though. <laughs> <laughs> that face like... Oh, okay. shoot. All right. Uh, let me see. Uh, oh, yeah. Right, man. Finish your turn. Tally Kinesis. Tally Kinesis. <laughs> he dropped five dollars. I see you in a minute, Tally. What's up? Well, <laughs> Tri- <you> triple. <laughs> He says the best horror movie trailer I can remember is Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2003. Great pacing and chills. That was just like... Gory, huh? Yeah. I like. I watched the Texas Chainsaw Massacre in theaters too. It was pretty freaking, pretty good, man. I think that might be yeah. one of the best franchises. It was wild, bro. It's one of the best. It's, horror- it's some. It's about him being so big yeah. and so fast. That chainsaw, man. Yeah, yeah. That leather face. He don't talk. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy, man. So yeah, Here's this, the this is definitely a <laughs> horror, whatever the freak you want to call it. Uh, freak what you talking uh, about? It's thriller based, bro. Whatever, bro. Pe- people, people on fire. Yeah, people on fire. Yes, yeah, we see it, man. On fire. And that <laughs> little girl. That little girl's definitely a, a demonic <clears throat> entity of some sort. No, she's not. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know Look at his face. You know what you're saying? <laughs> what a say it. Go ahead and say it. Hey, 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 no, she was. She wasn't like that in the trailer. Like we didn't in it the didn't, movie. She's a demonic me. entity. No. No. Was she possessed? Somewhat. Was she possessed any kind of way? Somewhat. Really, they took they 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 did some to her. Before, oh, that's why she had that, that long neck. Before that, no, but but they he he was saying was she always like that? No, she was always like oh, okay. that. I like how you added that always in there. See, <laughs> see how you that all. I didn't say always. I said in this movie, she demonic, bro. Do you agree? No. Freaking, you know, Ronan go deep with the horror, bro. It take a lot for him to consider something demonic. Mm-hmm. That boy was though. The yeah. son was. Anybody, the son, the son, anybody son, the son it was, was just implied. It was yeah. that's why was, when you said thriller psychological. It was implied the boy was hor- did, did it, it show they, you? they didn't show hell. Did they, they didn't show did, did they hell. show hell? No, they didn't. Or right. have to show they that said, before they, they, before they, they said it though. They said it though. One, one of the kings of hell. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. my god. Yeah, yeah. What did they say? Uh, you're, did we see it? It made it. It, it may seem holy because everything was so light and everything gotcha. like that. And they, they was like, uh, they was like, oh, you're you're a uh, uh, you're Paimon, one of the seven kings of hell. Yeah. 
<laughs> and then that's where it ends. And that's where yeah, it ends. That's where it ends. Okay. That's where it ends. But, right. but, but, but yeah, but I would yeah. like to thank all of you so very much <laughs> for watching Jody's Corner <laughs> number eighteen. I appreciate the donations, the text, the recommendations, the panel, everybody. Thank you. Don't forget, you can come and check us out this Friday, June twenty first, in Gardena for the Just Us League live event. We will be there this Friday in Gardena. That's going to be fire, my G. I can't it wait will. to see. I can't wait to see, y'all. Hey, hey, I, might, I might wear my fire flints, homie. We'll see. Woo. Mm, I already right. know what, what, what uh, shoes I'm going to wear. Ben 97, thank you. Yeah, I already <laughs> know what shoes I'm going to wear, too. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I, think, I think we all do. <laughs> yeah, S.C. Smith too. We know. We, I don't we, think you do. What are you wear? Okay, you don't. You don't. Okay. Oh, shoot, five. All right. I like to thank uh, HT3 for ah! uh, Milky. Still Milky. I like to thank the Flash for being Yo, here, bro. What's up, man? To the Me Flash. and my do rag to make it stop by. Yeah, all that. I like to thank the homie Rona Joe Genji for, thank for you. popping up. Thank you very much, Rona. I appreciate your your input. You've been lovely today, man. Every, all you guys, we did. This was always, great, always, man. Great. Uh, well, what? Oh, I forgot to say, J3 couldn't be here today, guys, in the beginning. He couldn't make it. Obviously, the Flash is here in this spot. <laughs> but he'll probably be here tomorrow. Thank you guys Flash so very much here, for tuning in. <laughs> uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow for Jody's Corner episode 19, 10 a.m. All right, guys, we the panel. We got this thing. Deuces. Have a great day.